Okie doke. We are live. Indeed, we are very cool. Hello, everybody. I am Technovoid. Uh, it's been a while. It's been like a month since I last streamed. Just thing after thing after thing after thing happening <laughs> every week that I just did not have any opportunities to actually start a Mori, which I've been meaning to do for quite some time. A lot longer than a month. This game has been on my radar. This game has been on my radar, like, low-key for a good while. It's been on my radar high-key for about... Probably, I mean, probably around the time. I mean, it's it's been one of the games that's been on my radar pretty much since since the uh, I started with the the weird core stuff with Yume Nikki. So I guess it's been like two years now at this point. So it's definitely been a while. Um, one of the things that sort of has stopped me from getting into this one it is an RPG, which I tend to enjoy less. The menu-based RPGs I played off and. The gameplay of off was my least favorite part, but I am very excited otherwise because I do, from my understanding, I know this is Lynx is one of Lynx's favorite games, uh, so I'm looking forward to seeing uh, how this game goes. But let's let's just let's jump in. I do know that as soon as I get my save file, I'm gonna have to close the stream or at least close the game and replace my save file with another save file because uh, I want. It to be as weird as possible, and apparently that's limited in some ways. What is happening here? Don't worry. Okay. I wasn't planning on it, really. Everything is gonna be okay. That's good! Yeah, it's, it's fine, man. No matter what happens. Promise me that we'll always be there for each other. Oh. Promise me. Okay, this, this took a turn, maybe. Uh, okay. I promise. I think. Welcome to White Space. Got all the necessities right there. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. I mean, you got a computer, you got a light. What else do you need? Amori's even got them tissues. That is a pretty white space. All right, let's see what we got. A tissue box for wiping your sorrows away. I'm, yeah, for sure. Meow? Waiting for something to happen. A light bulb ha hangs from the ceiling, wherever it is. Look into the light bulb? Uh, sure. It's pitch black inside. You can't see a thing! Your sketchbook. Take a look inside. Why not? Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, dead. Uh. Okay, that's actually genuinely pretty good. A little bit disturbing, potentially, but genuinely pretty good. Hmm. Hey, do you need to talk? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I, I... I think the kid needs counseling, you guys. It's on my computer. What's on the pooter? You booted up your laptop. What would you like to do? Let's stare at the screen, why not? You stared at the screen. What would you like to do? I'd like to stare at the screen some more. Cool. Let's open up my journal. Day unknown. Okay, they're all day unknown. Today, I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today, I spent time in white space. Everything was okay. Today, I visited my friends. Everything was okay. It's okay. Alright. Everything is okay, apparently. So, why not? 
Uh, I'd like to like, go off, I think. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Something fell nearby. Something just happened. Something fell nearby. I wonder how far out I can go. Oh, what the? Oh. Are these things that, like, don't want me to leave? They're, like, trying to keep me... You got a shiny knife! Okay. Hmm. I, I have an equip. Oh, well, I have it! I don't know why it's here, but I have it. Come grab me. Send me back. Cool. Can I go through this door? A white door casts a faint shadow. What would you like to do? Open it. Who's gonna feed the cat, though? Hello. Hi, Amori. We were hoping you'd come by soon. Wanna play cards with us? We were just about to start another game. Oh. Whoops. Never mind. Aw, oh, man. What the heck, Aubrey? You messed up all the cards. I was winning, too. Hey there, Kel. There's no need to get angry. It's just a game after all. Didn't give me that, hero. You only say that because you were losing. Hmm. Damn, Trudeau. Uh, what do we got over here? A tentacle is poking out of the ground. That's normal. You got a stuffed toy. Oh. She didn't seem happy about that. There's a movie on TV. Four boys walking on railroad tracks. A cat-shaped hole. Why is Kel always so mean to me? You know, the other day that good-for-nothing stole my stuffed toy and hid it somewhere in this room. Why would he do something like that? He's so immature. I mean, what did I ever do to him? Oh, I know. Can you find my stuffed toy for me, Amari? For you, please? Uh, yeah. Is that... Could it be? Aubrey snatched the stuffed, the stuffed toy from you. Hey, Kel! Look, it's my stuffed toy! What, what the heck? Where'd you find... Where'd, where'd you get that? Amori found it. Lucky for me, I've got some real friends. Serves you right, Kel. You should know better than to pick on others. But Aubrey started it. She was the one making fun of me for the mole on my... on your... what? Aubrey? <sighs> Fine. Thank you, Amori. I knew I could count on you. You're the best. Hey, Amori. I'm glad that's all settled. Those two always seem to be bumping heads. Mary and Basil invited us for a picnic at the playground. Did you want to go see them? No. Okay, no worries. We'll be here. Man, Aubrey gets what always gets what she wants. A fluffy pillow shaped like the head of a girl. That's normal. Would you like to make toast? Yeah, I would. You made toast. Fantastic. A photo of someone familiar. Oh, a neatly wrapped present. A blender. Sss, waiting for something to happen. Yeah. I just stepped on an egg. A single bean on a plate. Oh. Can I leave? Your friends are waiting for you. That's so cool of them. You can't leave without your friends. Oh, alright. A baseball and a baseball bat. Yeah, sure, let's go. Alright, everyone. Let's go see Mary and Basil. Oh, hell yeah. We're partied up. Going out, Amari. Here's your allowance for today. You got 50 clams. What am I going to do with clams? Why are we selling clams out here? No! Oh, 
yeah! Fresh air at last! Hey, Stormy. Gotta love that nature. Well, let's go. Hey, wait a sec. Help me, you guys. I'm stuck. Only if you say please. Kel, stop messing around and get me out of here. Okay, okay, fine. Hm. Took you long enough. Well, sorry, princess. What the hell is that thing? <laughs> oh, that's the hopscotch with the creepy eye in the journal. Oh, there's a, there's a lot of things going on over here. It's a whole, a whole ass playground. Mary Basil! Oh, hello Aubrey. Hello everyone. How are you all doing today? Who's being mean to me again? Oh no, not again. How could he? <laughs> I'm not being mean, Aubrey's just being whiny. Well, Kel, you've just made a very convincing point. Now I don't know who to believe. Believe me! No, believe me! Settle down, you two. Why does it always have to be like this? Chin up, hero. Look at you being all responsible. I really like that about- Oh my, okay. Even in the bedroom eyes already? Come on, Mary. Not now. Oh, hero, you know I'm just teasing. You're so cute when you get all flustered. We were waiting for you guys. Basil and I were going through his photo album. Did you want to join us? Of course. After all, we're the ones in the pictures, aren't we? Basil, Basil, get a load of this! Sorry, Kel. I only take pictures of photos of people when they least expect it. You'd like to take photos of people acting naturally when they're not in front of a camera, right, Basil? Yeah. There's something special about everyone living their own lives. Those are the moments I want to capture. So, like, we just have to pretend you're not there? Uh, I guess you could put it that way. Sure, I could do that. D did you want to show us your photo album now, Basil? Okay, uh, but it's nothing amazing. Oh, Basil, stop doubting yourself. I'm sure they'll be great. Uh, you're right, Aubrey. Uh, sorry. I'll try and believe in myself more. Here. This way we can all see. Oh, that's, uh, that's, uh, Amorian... Who was that? Kel? Schiff. Oh, that I can read? Oh, it's Mary. Mary's teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Amori and Kel are... Oh, it is Kel. They're holding Mary's example. So pretty. Amori and Kel gave up and ran off, but Aubrey and I got the hang of it really fast. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting it. You have to admire his persistence. Everyone's eating watermelons. So juicy. Aubrey has some seats on her face. Maybe someone should tell her. Kel drinking a bottle of milk, his favorite. I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Mary had Hero take a picture of us. Everyone thinks a flower crown really suits me. Hero leaning in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, uh, brotherly love. We're having a picnic today. Wait, what? Hold, well, now this is a picture that is being taken that everyone is aware of, though. Oh, Mary wanted to take a picture of everyone. Fine. Say cheese. After eating, everyone fell asleep except for Hero and Mary. I'm getting kind of sleepy myself. Kel said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. All of our feet in a circle. Man, there is definitely one here that stands out, huh? <laughs> in all these pictures. One person who's a little bit different. Can you guess whose feet are whose? a little bit on the nose, potentially. Yeah, I think I can. There's some good pictures. These, 
These photos are also charming, Basil. You really know how to capture the moment. Thanks. I didn't take all of them, though. Mary likes to steal my camera sometimes. <laughs> Only sometimes. Hey, I have an idea. Did you all want to come hang out at my house? I just finished planting some little sprouts and wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Yeah, sure, that sounds like fun. Let's go. It's south of the playground, right? Yep, that's the way. I'll sit this one out. You all go on and enjoy yourselves. But if you're ever feeling weary, you can always stop by one of my picnics. I'll always have some refreshments ready. And you can even save using my picnic basket. Aw, thanks, Mary. You're always doing so much for us. Bye, Mary. We'll see you again soon. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Ah, yes, some nutritious candy. Would you like to eat some? Oh, that must be the full heal. Hell yeah. Run along and have fun now. You know where to find me. Okay, so now we save. Okay, all right. And now I close the game. Ah! And we will be back momentarily. I need to replace a game file. Uh, where is that going to be? Um, but da da da. That. Where is that button? There it is. Um, program files. Thanks. Uh, for anybody wondering what it is I'm doing, there is a value in this game called the WTF value uh, that ranges, I think, from like 1 to 15. Uh, and the higher the value, the more strange things happen in the game. And since I'm all about those strange things, I figured I would uh, I would uh, set mine as high as possible just so I'm not leaving it up to a random chance how many weird things I see. So, uh... My good friend Vlinx was able to help me. What? I can't find that. Hold on. Okay, let me try that again. Um, go there. Or Steam here. There. That Steam ads. I don't. Ah, I know where it's saved. There we go. That explains the issue. So I go in here and then I go in here. And then I replace, I can just replace that. I assume just do this, uh, replace the file on the destination. Okay. That should hopefully do everything it needs to do. Oh, am I screen sharing this? I didn't realize I was screen sharing that. It's fine. Tag up with Amori. Uh, yeah, it's like fun value. The different, the main difference is fun value is um. Uh, for fun value, it changes like, like each fun value has something different on it. So like one has something, and then two has something, and then three has something. Um, 
Whereas in Amori, so like a lower value can have something that a higher value doesn't have. Whereas in Amori, just the higher it is, the more stuff you see. So the lower values just have less things and there are like flags that says, if your value is above X, also put this in. So I wanted to make sure we had that. Why is it not showing Amori? There we are. All right. Let's hop back into it. And now we should have a, now we should have the max WTF value. So we should get all that creepy crawlies. All right, what's going on here? I'm gonna swing to the moon. Yeah, that's, that's nice, son. No boss zone, violators will be prosecuted. Burly talks so fast when she's excited, it gets really hard to keep up. Hey, Amari, guess what? I got some plans today, big plans. Just stay put for a while. You'll see what I mean soon enough. Uh, okay. Sure. Nose is my best friend. She can't say much, but she's really smart. It, she's a nose. Oh, hey, wait just one second. Where do you all think you're going? I don't know. I was gonna go somewhere. You can't leave without joining us for a game of hide and seek. Stay and play with us. The more the merrier. You wanna play hide and seek again? But, you know how this turned out last time. Y yeah, sorry, Burly. I think we're gonna have to pass. We're going to Basil's house now, so we'll catch up with you later. Not so fast! You guys trying to avoid me again? What's up with you two? This is my face. My rough and tough exterior. At least I'm not as bad as boss. It's a good thing I banned him from the playground after what happened last time. I wonder what that moron is up to now. Eh, good riddance. So, you wanna play hide and seek, Basil? Uh, I can go either way. Uh, there's no rush to get to my house after all. I think I'll leave it up to Amari. Uh, what do you wanna do? Let's play some damn hide and seek. Amori, Amori, my best friend, come on, you know how to play hide and seek, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> That's what I thought. What's stopping you then? Come on, let's play. I'll round everyone up. Dan hut. All right, maggots, here is the rules. We're gonna be entertaining ourselves a little game of hide and seek. Here in my hands, I got some straws. See, everyone here is gonna pick a straw. The one with the shortest straw is gonna be it, and we'll have to find everyone else. Let me guess. I'm it. Sounds easy enough, right? Yeah, this little candy corn, bro. We all got our straws? Good. Now, let's see who's gonna be it. Well, 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 looks like the one with the shortest straw is Amori. Oh, wait, Amori is it? But Amori doesn't like to be alone. Are you gonna be okay, Amori? I can take your place if you want. I don't mind, really. Hey, I hear you plotting over there. The straws make the rules, not me. Come on, don't be babies, it ain't so bad. Amori will be fine. When you're ready to play, walk up to the tetherball pole and close your eyes. And no peeking, or else. Okay. Five, four, three, two. Are they gonna hide that fast? Go! Whoa, you found me! And now I can help you find everyone. Just don't tell Burley about this guy today. Man, Kel's a real one, though. Hey, Mary, what up? Hi, hey, Amori. I see everyone decided to stay a bit to play hide and seek. If you're having a hard time, I can lend you a hand. Big Sister's always here for you. <laughs> So, would you like some help? No. I'm fine. Oh. Nose goes! Shh, if you're too loud, they'll hear us. Nose goes, button goes! Ah, be quiet, nose, we're hiding, remember? Aha! We found you, bun and nose. Nose, they found us. Nose goes. Oh, you know I can't stay mad at you. Let's go play patty cake. Oh, there are not many places to hide for a guy my size, but this was still fun. As long as Burley is happy, I'm happy. 
darn, you found me. I guess that means I lose. You know what Happy would say right now? She'd say something like, Bangs, you should always try your best at everything. Also, people will see how awesome you are. Eh, next time, I guess. <laughs> Boing, it's me, Happy. You found me, so that means I gotta do something else now. Oh, I know, I'm gonna count the other but backwards. Happy. I like your energy. Z Y X W V U O M O um, O. Oh. oh, they're gonna spell out a Mori. Uh, that's not hide and seek. Ah! <laughs> okay, <laughs> who are these two? <sighs> We're not playing. We're exercising. Okay, that's cool. Is this a banana? A turtle banana. together, Amori. Who in the hell? Where am I? I was dreaming I was on a private beach with servants fanning me, with palm tree leaves on every side, when suddenly, wham! And now here I am. I must have fallen asleep while hiding. I guess it's game over for me. Uh, hey, hero. Oh, hey, guys. Uh, you know, I found a really good hiding spot, but uh, Sean and Ren invite me to join them in their exercise routine. It's fun and good for you. You guys really should try this. It's really a workout. Oh man, I'm so tired. Wow, you really don't know how to say no to anyone, do you, Hero? Ah, come on, Hero, we gotta help Amori find everyone else. All right, all right, I'm coming. Uh, bye, Sean, bye, Ren, this was fun. Yeah, let's do it again sometime. See you later, Hero. Suspicious blue mailbox. It's very suspicious. Can I can I stab it? Do I keep the knife? I do have the shiny knife. Awesome. There is a straw in the ground. Pull it out. Oh no, we're gonna kill Burly. <laughs> You guys long enough. I thought I was gonna suffocate in there. How'd you leave my hiding spot? Pretty good, eh? It looks like you pretty much found everyone else, too. Unexpected, but I like it. Let's do a final roll call. Ten Hut! Van! There's always, buddy. Charlene! Here. Nicole! What gifts? Happy. Yeah, yeah. Browse. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Thanks. Here. Bun. Barney's here. Nose. Nose goes. Hero. Present. Kel. <sighs> you really gotta do this every time, Burly. Hey, that wasn't called for. Dobry. Here I am. I saw him hiding near that tree over there. Basil, where are you? Can you hear us? Basil! You can come out now. You already won. Hello, Basil! Is it Basil or Basil? Hey, there's Basil. Basil, are you okay? Or are you stuck? Oh shit! The tree was paper this whole time! <laughs> Wait, I thought this was a boss free zone. I should have known it was you, you good for nothing scoundrel! Let Basil go! Yeah, what did Basil ever do to you? Basil is our friend. Don't you dare hurt him! 
Let go of Basil, boss. He didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> you stupid heads! You think this is about Basil? Don't pray, John. You know why I'm here. How oh, dare you not invite me to hide and seek? I'm the one who showed you all how to play in the first place. You're not even playing it right. How can you go and hide and seek without any body slamming? <laughs> Boss does make a good point. My flower crown! Hey, that's the flower crown we made for Basil. How could you? Let go of him, you bully. No, if I can't play with everyone, then no one can. We, we just finished playing. This is a boss only show now. And you're not invited. <laughs> I'm gonna... Uh, let's, let's just attack. That was a knife. I just stabbed this man. <laughs> you weaklings! You call that an attack! Oh, I hit right in the heart. Boss punches Amari. Uh, okay, let's take a look at what else we have. Sad poem. Inflict sad on a friend or foe. Guard. X first. Reducing damage taken for one turn. Okay, so we got defense and we can make them sad. We don't have any snacks. We don't have any toys. What do you have? Pep talk makes a friend or foe happy. Okay, okay, so they probably all have one. Makes a friend or foe angry. No way. Cool. Okay, and then... Oh, you heal a friend. Okay, so you're healing and everyone else is. So you're kind of like the support, I guess. We're just stabbing him. Hey, that kind of hurt. Mm, this isn't fun anymore. Boss cracks his knuckles. I'm going to murder him now. Now you've made me angry. It's time for my special move. Body slam. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh my god. All Everyone's becoming toast. Amori did not succumb. Huh? How are you still moving? gonna murder him. Oh, he's fucking dead. So did I just... No, he seems fine. That's... Well... This is fair. Rematch! I want a rematch! Basil, are you hurt? Uh, don't worry about me, I'm just fine. Boss, it must hurt to see people have fun without you. But that doesn't mean you can ruin other people's fun. Mm, I know that! There. Does that feel better? Basil, are you sure it's okay to do that? Boss is bad news! It's a good thing I'm already held on during that final attack or else we would've all been toast. It's okay, I trust him. When you were all fighting, he tried really hard to make sure that I didn't get hurt. Is that true, boss? Hmm, hmm, listen right below me. I don't need to hear these lies. This is my spot. No one is welcome here. Aw. <laughs> He's fun, I like him. Uh, well, he probably won't be a problem as long as he stays like that. I guess that means we can go to Basil's house now. Sounds good to me. We're leaving now, boss. Uh, don't cause any trouble, okay? Mm. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. What else we got? I'm gonna swing to the moon, right? You are gonna swing to the moon. Oh yeah, do I need to heal up? How does my hit? Yeah, no, they're all they're all fully fine. 
I like puzzles. That's so cool of you. Hello, friends. Nothing is worth the risk. Oh no, that's ominous. I don't know what you mean by that. I want to give flowers to someone, but he's only really interested in puzzles. If only I could find a flower puzzle or something, maybe then he would notice me. Noted. Oh, did you guys die? Or no, you're just laying down. That's good. Internal banana. Yes, yes, hello, valued customer. Welcome to my shop. Please buy some drink. You're just, you're just in there, huh? Kills 30 heart, kills 25 juice. So juice is MP, basically. Apparently better than orange juice. That's a, that's a hard sell. Jax, reduce speed. It's not what you wanted. Damn, that's so sad. Well, have you know I don't appreciate window shoppers. That's too bad for you. Hop, and a hop, and a hop, and a hop. <laughs> Having fun takes too much effort, so watching my friends have fun is enough for me. Peekaboo. Hey, Joker Jash. Wait a morning, we're supposed to go to my house. It's just past the past the path south of the playground. I just finished planting some little sprouts and I wanted to show everyone. Come on, they're really cute. Okay. Let me save though. So we're looking for a flower puzzle to keep that in mind. Eternal banana. Train station, pinwheel forest, Basil's house. I think we're going there. Hello, butterfly. A watering can. These are sunflowers. They're called that because they always face towards the sun. That's how I want to be like, someone who always sees the bright side of things. Good for you. That's that's a good way of thinking. These flowers are called Lily of the Valley. Oh, uh, wait, Walter White used these, didn't he? That bastard. Said that they're able to ward off evil spirits and help people see a brighter future. I guess that's why they remind me of Mary. Aren't they also like extremely poisonous? I can always count on her to help me stay positive. <laughs> What's that ugly plant creature? Don't you know, Kel? That's your mom! That's a sprout. Oh, okay. Sprout molds are highly intelligent creatures, but become dangerously vicious when they're lost. Please, Mr. Sprout Mold, stop that. You're stomping all over the flowers. I think he's mad. I think, I think we're fighting. Hell yeah! Ah, looks like this sprout mole is angry. Uh, like us, sprout moles are also feel emotions. Uh, since this sprout mole is angry, its attack is higher. But on the other hand, it lowers its defense. So what you're s so what you're saying is now is the perfect time to strike. Come on, Amari, let's do this. Tracks do bop. Oh, okay. I found tofu? Hell yeah. Level two, what do we get for leveling up? Ah, uh, most of the flowers are unharmed. That's relief. Hey, uh, Amori, uh, now that we're getting the hang of battling, here's a journal where we can keep track of any neat foes we come across. Here, we're gonna be the faux facts journal. There, now it's in your pocket. The journal is yours to record with, but uh, we might pitch in sometimes too. Check it out through your pocket in the player menu by pressing X. Faux facts. A, a dangerous and hostile ugly, ugly plant creature. It says it is smart, but do not believe it. It is not. It smells like dirty laundry. Okay. <laughs> Works for me. 
Wait, why am I missing health? Tell me about these, Basil. These are roses. Can you guess who they remind me of? They remind me of Hero. Oh, I thought they reminded you of someone named Rose. That makes sense, though. Did, did you guess correctly? No. Roses come in many different colors and have their own unique meanings. Pink roses symbolize admiration. Orange roses symbolize... S symbolize... Jesus, my language today. Passion. Yellow roses symbolize friendship. And the list goes on. Hero doesn't remind me of any rose in particular. I think Hero is like all roses because he's first and universally loved. That's awesome. Love that for Hero. Uh, these are a type of flower called the gladiolus. The gladio what? Gladiolus, also known as the sword flower. As you might guess, they represent the strength of character. Someone who is honest with strong moral values. Someone who stands by their convictions. The gladiolus reminds me of Aubrey because she's always true to herself. Oh, I see. So what you're saying is, Aubrey is real stubborn. Hey, no I'm not. <laughs> okay, let's move on. What? Another guy. Oh, they're going to teach me all the emotions. Oh, no, not again. Please, Mr. Sproutmole, stop twirling. You're destroying all the flowers. Oh, uh, I see. This Sproutmole is happy. In that case, it has a higher chance to hit our weak spots and do more damage. But this also means it has a higher chance of missing. Okay, so... Angry, glass cannon, happy is basically luck-based. You're either critting or missing. I'm assuming the volume is fine, because nobody in chat has said, like, please lower the volume of anything. Wait, what? Oh, he- I see, he missed on hit. I, I wasn't fully paying attention there. He's rolling around! What an idiot! across a lot of foes with emotion. In case you didn't know, emotions can determine how strong or weak an attack is. Uh, happy beats angry. Oh, really? Oh, interesting, okay. Happy beats angry, angry beats sad, and sad beats happy. That... Okay, that tracks. It's just a easy rock, paper, scissors. Here, even drew up a guide on how they work. I'm no artist, but I think you'll get the point. I'll put it in your pocket so you can check it out later. You've got an emotion chart. Do you want to look at the emotion chart now? Sure. Okay, so happy increases luck and speed and decreases hit rate. Strong is exactly what it said. Sad increased defense, lowered speed. Oh, cause you're like you're like going in on yourself. You're becoming depressed. Some damage to heart goes to your juice. Interesting. Okay, that's pretty unique. I'm guessing this combat system is probably gonna have a lot of switching your own and switching the enemies. I I don't know how much I will use it. I will probably need to. We'll see. So we have to fight a sad guy. Oh, what are these flowers called? They're all cool and spiky. Actually, Kel, this is a cactus. It's more of a plant than a flower. And it's funny that you ask because they remind me of you. Is it because he's a prick? Ooh. Ooh, that hurts. Hey. Well, that too, but mostly because cacti are very sturdy and resilient plants by nature. Uh, they don't need much care and can survive in even seemingly impossible conditions. I guess what I'm saying is, even you could take care of a cactus, Kel. Wow, neat! Cacti are awesome! Damn, these two hate each other. Ah, these are white tulips. Plain, simple, and bulbous. Just like a mori. Am I bulbous? Is that a word you would use to describe me, Basil? I don't know, I just think it's cute. Uh, not another sprout mole. Bro, this one is in the throes of depression. It's all good, Basil. We got the hang of this by now. He's catatonic. Don't be mean. Sprout mole seems a bit sad. See how it's curled up in the fetal position? <laughs> Jesus Christ. That means it won't do as much damage as normal, but it'll also take less damage to heart and will lose juice instead. How sad. Let's put it out of its misery! True. What does my skill do? 
Right, I can make someone sad. Uh, Aubrey, you make someone happy. Okay, I'll make them mad. Hit it right in the heart. Oh, wait, I made Kel angry. Oops. I thought I was I thought I was making the enemy angry. I probably just read that wrong. Okay, so now Kel should be doing more damage. Does angry beat sad? Yeah, angry does beat sad. It's all intentional. Hero learned massage. Removes a friend or foe's emotion. Okay, so hero is very much a support. That's cool. I like him. You got a lot of flowers on the way to your house. Oh, hey, Mary. Hi, everyone. You all came just in time for a lovely picnic. Feel free to rest here. Everything's already set up, and I even brought some fruit. Do you want to have a picnic with your friends? Of course I do. Man, Amora doesn't seem like they're having that much fun. Ah, uh, yes, some delicious fruits. Woohoo! Thanks, Mary, you're the best! Oh, it's nothing. I'm just trying to look out for all of you. Ah, uh, Mary, I wish I could be more like you. You always seem to have everything under control. That's not true at all. It just seems that way from the outside. Either way, you sure seem to make everything look easy. Yes, I agree. Mary's so effortlessly graceful. Don't you think so, Amori? Yeah. Aw, I guess I have to believe it a little bit if all of you think so. My house is right down this way. Are we all ready to go? I'm ready when you are. We'll catch you later, Mary. Let me know if you need anything. See you soon. I would like to say thank you. That was really far. Oh. Oh, did we piss off big, big guy by by ruining the the lives of his of his children? All right. Does he have an emotion right now? He old sprout. What emotion would I want to give him? Not sad. I can make him happy and make him. Less like, or I could make. He doesn't have an emotion, but if I gave him an emotion, I could hit him super effectively. I would like to be angry, which means I would want to make him sad. Although then I'm removing some of his MP, which he doesn't have. Um, sad means happy. What is happy? Angry. Happy beats angry. So I can make him angry. So I'll do that. Um. Sprout feels angry. Oh, uh, Amori being happy is kind of freaky. Oh shit, that hit everyone? Alright, well I am happy and I have a knife, so I'm gonna stab this man. Um, you start making other people happy. What? Oh, right, that's what happens when you're happy. You can do it! Oh man, 
This fight is pretty tough. But don't worry, we can do it if we work together. It looks like I'm gonna have to teach you a little bit about teamwork. Let's try again, Amari. We'll get him this time. What? I was doing fine. Notice anything different, Amari? You can see a new bar at the bottom of the screen with a number by the side. This is our collective energy. By using our energy, we can defeat this foe together. Just attack and you'll see. I didn't realize we were still uh, in this mode, so I'll just do regular attacks then. What? Missing something? <laughs> Do you see the bubbles that popped up when we attack? That's called a follow up. After you attack, for a limited time, you can use energy to perform a follow up. Just press any directional arrow and see what happens. I, I did. Nothing happened. that our energy went up. When we take damage, we also gain energy. Think of it as a chance to make a comeback. What does passing a hero do? Oh, we dunked on him? And then we don't have energy. Okay. Okay, so we can't do it if it's, if it's great out. Full of energy. This would be the perfect time to use our special attack. Mori, after you attack, press down to release energy. I hope you're all ready. Come on, everyone, let's show this big guy what we're made of. Oh no. We're gonna murder this poor old man. That was necessary. <laughs> okay. And learn stab. Mm, I wish I didn't. Don't know how I feel about that. And there you have it. Heroes Battle Tutorial 101. And I'm sure that as we fight more battles, our teamwork will improve over, over time. Wow, you guys. That was so amazing. That was nothing. <laughs> I've taken down way bigger guys than that. I should teach you some of my skills one of these days. <sighs> Basil, I know you're not the type that likes to fight, but it's good to know how to defend yourself, too. You know, I've actually been working on a book all about battles. Maybe we can all study it together next time. I'll give it to Amori to hold on for now. You got the self-help guide. As we get stronger, I'll be updating the follow-up section of the self-help guide, so make sure to check it out every now and again. Uh, Amori, you should know, uh, when we gain EXP and level up, sometimes we'll also learn skills. Skills are powerful and have a wide range of effects, but each of us can only remember four skills at a time. Do y'all just Pokemon? After you learn a skill, don't forget to equip it from the player menu, okay? Yeah, yeah, we know. Can we go to Basil's house now? Okay, that's all I had to say. Patience, Kel. So I need to equip step. No, I have step. Always deals a critical hit. Ignore defense when Amori is sad. Ooh. Yeah. It would be like that, wouldn't it? Bro, Basil, you living in a fucking shoe? you do when people aren't paying attention. Oh, I came out kind of blurry. Well, that's okay. Th that gives it character. Hope you don't mind the photo. Of course we don't mind. I want to see it. Oh, sure thing. We all look so cute. How's my hair? I want to see. I want to see. Oh, hey, Amori, did you want to look at the photo, too? 
It's too bad that it came out kind of blurry, but you all still look so cute. I should add it to my collection. Woohoo! Another shot for the photo album! Ooh, over Aubrey! I can't see! Hey, stop pushing! You already had your turn! Get out of my way, Kel! Wait, 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 hold on, there's no need to fight! Me first! No, me! Bro, you're over and Basil! Stop it! Stop it! You guys are knocking me over! Oh, auto pictures went everywhere. Uh, whoops. Oh my gosh, Basil, I'm so sorry. Are you okay, Basil? You two are in big trouble now. This is why both of you need to learn how to get along. I'm sorry, we didn't mean it, Hero. Uh, please don't tell Mary. It's okay, don't worry about it. Accidents happen. Here's your photos. Doesn't look like any of them got damaged. Let's put them back in your photo album together. Uh, thank you, Hero. Uh, let's go inside my house first. Remember to wipe your feet before you come in. Brother, you live in a shoe. I'll just wipe your, your fucking whole ass house. Bunch of potted plants and flowers. Basil loves taking care of things. Do you happen to have uh, any uh, uh, flower uh, uh, things? Flower puzzles? Bunch of books, mostly about plant care. You ready to put back the photos, Amori? Sure, why not? Yay, let's get started. Mm, darn, I don't think I remember the order of all these photos. Don't worry about a thing, Basil. Amori has a really good memory, so I'm sure we'll figure this out in no time. Even though at least half of it was Kel's fault. Yeah, I promise to never fight with Aubrey again, unless she starts first. Uh, don't worry about it. I know you only wanted to see my photo album. Uh, thank you for helping me put it back together. Oh? Hmm? That's strange. A photo must have been loose. Huh? What is this? Did I take this photo? Something about it seems so familiar. No, 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 no. That that can't that can't be. Mary, what the fuck, Basil? What did you do? Oh, yeah. Not much to do around here, is there? True. Let's take a look at that sketchbook again. Yeah. This is what a normal person does. Boot up your laptop. Everything was okay. Indeed it was. The heat from the laptop warmed your lap. It felt nice. Can I... Get around these guys again. Ah! I'm escaping. Although there doesn't seem to be anything worthwhile. I guess it was just the knife. So, uh... There's no door. Are 
looking for a way out. Meow. There is always one, but... Meow. Waiting for something to happen. I hear that heartbeat. Do I need to let one of the hands just grab me this time? Oh, no. Ah. Okay, I, I, I was thinking it might be that. Well, credits roll, everybody. It's honestly, Amori, not as good as I was expecting. Kind of thought this would be a longer game, but you know, it is what it is. Look at all of us. These are all the all our memories together. They're a little sad now. But we should be happy that they happened at all. Let's go make some new memories together, okay? Troublesome, potentially. The slightest bit worrisome. You see a boy sleeping in his room. What's his name? Sonny. The boy's name is Sonny? Yeah. Hey, Sonny. You didn't just stab yourself in a dream, did you? Hey, Sonny. It's Mommy. I'm still in the city setting things up for our new home. Did you finish packing yet? The movers are going to be at our house in a few days, so I left a list of things for you to do before they arrive. Also, sorry, Mommy messed up. I forgot to tell the electric company that we need a few extra days before we're ready to move, so the lights might be cut out for some time tonight. Anyway, I know moving to a new place can be a little nerve-wracking right now, but I think a change of scenery will be positive for both of us. I know you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but you might want to say goodbye to your old friends before we leave. Cal's been trying really hard to get a hold of you ever since we put the house up for sale. He's been calling us every week for the past few months. He seems a little lonely. Maybe you should pay him a visit. Okay, that's it for now. Mommy loves you. Bye, honey. Bzz. You are hungry. True. I am hungry. Hey, Sonny, this is a note from Mommy. I left some food in the fridge for you downstairs. It's steak, your favorite. Love you. Love you, Xoxo. Who's Xoxo? I named him Sonny. Nothing special about it. Cardboard boxes. Mom's to-do list. You don't feel like doing chores right now. That's valid. Small fake house plan. Ooh, the mirrors. I know there's some shit with the mirrors, right? Hi, Sonny. This is a note from Rami. Remember to brush your teeth every day. Love you. I'm on a high weird value, so... Oh, maybe there's nothing. I thought looking in the mirrors made creepy shit happen, but... Perhaps not. Bookcase has been cleared out. An empty picnic basket. Would you like to save? Sunny! Some family photos. Are you sure you want to go downstairs? Uh, yeah? I think so. 
No, no, I don't. Okay. Uh, but I'm I'm hungry. You don't want to look down. Then just look straight. Close your eyes. Close your eyes and go down the stairs. That's that's never been bad. You feel dizzy. Maybe you can sleep it off. Maybe. Mirror, mirror, mirror on the wall. Nothing. Can't stab myself. A very comfortable bed. Would you like to go to sleep? No. I'm a hungry as fuck, boy. Hey, post. Okay, I guess not. I guess we shall simply go to bed and... I will not sleep with these hunger pangs. See, I knew it. Sonny, you gotta listen. It's, it's normally bad to eat late at night, but you gotta do it. Oh, this is normal. An eerie red glow radiates from outside. You feel strangely drawn to it. Door is locked. Oh, are we in a nightmare now? See, it's fine. It's just... That's you, man, Nikki. Love that. <laughs> Hand staircase. Oh yeah, this is normal. This I experience this every night. Come on, Sonny. Don't be a pussy. Grab the knife. Grab the knife, Sonny. Uh, oh, oh, gee, okay. Um. Uh, I'd like to. I'd like to go. Actually, I. I would not mind leaving. I would not mind going. Uh, uh, oh, it's, uh, it's, hey, hey, it's Ani? It's getting caught up. Oh, no. Uh oh, I can't, can I go? I can't, I can't run. Do I have any skills? I, Sunny does not have any skills. Stop shoving me downstairs, that's rude. Hey, I told him. I don't think it's working, guy. Sunny. Something taunts Sunny as he falls. Why would you push me downstairs? That's so messed up. You really hurt me that way. Take a deep breath. Don't be afraid. It's not as scary as you think. You steady yourself and remember how to calm down. Remove emotions and heal some heart. Ah, oh, we're no longer afraid. We did it. We made it to the bottom of these stairs. Nope. You got a first aid kit. That could be useful. Nope, don't want to go there either. You look in the fridge and find a cold steak. Take it? Yeah. You got a cold steak. You should probably heat it up before you eat it. You picked up a steak knife. You put the cold steak in the microwave. You gotta hit it one second before it starts beeping. That's really rude. Ah, yes. A lovely, well-done steak. Would you like to eat some? Yeah. Now I can sleep nice and normal.
eating steak at midnight alone in the house. No wonder this guy's depressed. Oof, your stomach didn't agree with that. Yeah, because you fucking microwaved it, dipshit. Is there a bathroom? A fireplace. There are nails stuck between the bricks. No. Is there a bathroom nearby? We just shit. Oh, you threw up. Oh, that's not great. Okay, there's definitely more here now. It's not as dark. No. Hey, Sonny, it's Mary. I'm finally back home, but I forgot my keys. Could you open the door for me? Uh... Sure. Oh, okay. Uh, nope, didn't care for that. Fair enough. Hmm, still don't want to go in there, huh? My face. Do you see her face? There it is. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. Hey there, Mary. What's up? That's good. That's good. Fantastic. And thus the trauma begins, yes? Welcome to White Space. You've been living here for as long as you can remember. Oh yeah, I did this. Yeah. Anything new in our sketchbook? Oh, there's our steak. And there's that guy. That was different. Collect keys to fill in the blanks. Incorrect keys will be discarded to the right. Oh, I have to pick up. I see. Okay. Press Q to open up the hangman menu. Something fell nearby. Interesting. All right. I'm going, I'm going, Mr. Hand. Let's 
pitch black inside. You can't see a thing. I stared at the door. I stared at it real good. Oh, I cannot go through. really want to stab myself again. I guess we never actually used the laptop, did we? Right, I guess this is the only thing on the laptop right now. I don't have any of the keys. Kills five hearts. Cat, help me. found a map. Oh. Zero letters. Press W to open the headspace map. Is that enough? Open the door now. Weepy. Hey guys, what's up? Everyone doing good? That's good. I'm great. Mary's fine. I'm alright. Thank goodness you're here. Have you seen Basil? We can't find him anywhere. We should go tell Mary you're okay. She's been worried sick. I'm sure it's probably fine. I'll make some toast. I made toast. That's so cool of me. There's a movie on TV. Sss, going out in Maurice. Here is your allowance for today. Yo, my allowance got a hella big that time. Oh. Bloody footprints leading to an A key. Hangman's gonna be pretty ominous. Eleven keys left. Hey. that I cannot we should go see Mary she's been so worried about you all right fine fine just exploring this is not on my map Build sandcastle with your friends always. Yes, yeah, a normal thing that happens to normal people is that this, this that's currently, yeah, 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 
Yeah, no, we're, we're, we're good, right? Yeah, we're good. Well, that's fine. No issues there. Lamp post. Spooder web. You are afraid of spiders. Oh, well, thanks for letting me know. I'll make sure to add that to my resume. Oh, all the blood is gone. That's so nice of it. I'm back. I'm done stabbing myself. Amori, you're okay. Are you? Don't worry me like that. Where's Basil? He's not with you, Amori. No, I'm afraid not. Last thing I remember was sorting out photos of Basil in his house. Then he fucking lost his shit. Lost his goddamn marbles. Said your name in really creepy text. Picking up in neighbor's room with Aubrey and Kel. At least we found you, Amori. But I hope Basil's okay. Who's gonna protect him if we're not there? Don't be such a downer, Aubrey. We'll find Basil for sure. You're absolutely right, Kel. It's times like these when we gotta stay positive. We go back to Basil's house. There might be something there that we missed. That's the spirit hero. As always, I'll be right here if you need me. Why don't you come with us, sis? I'm sure I'd really appreciate having you directly behind me at all times. Swing to the moon. That's so cool. A bunch of small toy cars. Still looking for a puzzle for you. You guys are chilling. You guys are being chilling. I will go everywhere besides where I need to go. Okay, I will go exactly where I need to go. I'm being hen. Oh no, the the flowers are dead. We should do our best to take care of them until Basil gets back. Okay. Yeah, sure, why not? Water a plant back to life in Basil's garden. Those seem fine. Those seem fine. Hey, Basil. That, that, that's not Basil. That one ain't it. That one ain't Basil. I don't think. Well, there doesn't seem to be anything out of the ordinary. You think Basil just left somewhere without telling us? I don't know. That doesn't sound like him. He's usually so considerate about these things. Mm, guys, I'm really worried. Is there nothing we can do? What if we can't find him? What if he's in danger? Stay calm, Aubrey. I'm worried too, but that won't solve anything. Let's go look around the forest. Maybe he wandered off and got lost. Yeah, cheer up, Aubrey. We'll find Basil. You guys are right. Okay, we gotta keep our hopes up. Let's go look for Basil in the vast forest. Uh, you wanna tell me what that little crack on the ground is, though? A bookcase. Ah, uh, ah, ah, a choo! Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> Fighting a dust bunny? Okay. Let's fuck him up. This bunny is trying to keep itself together. Oh, dust bunny's sad as hell. Oh, well, we won. I got some clams. What do you guys have to say about... Dust bunnies. The sneeziest of all bunnies. Likes to hide in bookshelves and under the bed. Seems a little shy. There's a lot of fucking enemies in this game. 
A little rough around the edges can be a foe or a friend. The beloved grandfather of all sprout moles. It is said he loves all life in the forest and that all life in the forest comes from him. When he's not busy maintaining the balance of the forest, he enjoys sitting. Honestly, same. Sitting is cool. Yo, what up? Where's Basil? Have you seen him? Dude, if this is all Basil's yard, Basil's got some mad real estate. Transportation station doesn't seem to be in service. Fast for I found it! I found the place that Basil is, maybe. Here's a rabbit. That one's not made out of dust, probably. I mean, it could be. I could turn it into dust by murdering it. So there is that. Oh, there's blood over there. Okay. That's good. Basil! Basil, where are you? I know. I bet my pet rock will know what to do. Hector, be a good boy. Go find Basil. Yes, sir. Hector's the best character. You tried your best, buddy. True. This is no time to fool around, Kel. Hey, why you... Hector was just trying to help. Let it go, you two. We need to keep ourselves focused. Yeah, come on, Aubrey. Don't be a bitch. Hector is doing his best. Squawk? Bring me a forest. Squawk, squawk. Foggy bridge. Ah, uh, bunny. Bump, bump, bump. Oh, my attack fell. I will attack again. Well, I maybe shouldn't have done that because my attack is lowered. I will murder this rabbit. That rabbit hella lived. No, it's good. Jacks. Apple juice. It's a lot of. I think that's blood. I need to learn these other times. Pastor Mori. What does that do? Okay. I guess we won't do that. I'm sad now. You suck! You failed! and dandy about that. Alright, let's 
follow his blood this time. This is a pretty long ladder, huh? And it's pretty tall, but not as tall as the one east of the mice of, of the stump. That one goes all the way up to space. You're really afraid of heights, aren't you, Amori? It's okay. We don't have to look up there. Okay. Uh, but I do kind of want to go up there. There's, there's, there's blood. Alright, fine. She's enraged. She's beyond mad at this point. Aubrey's <laughs> fucking pissed. I need some health. dog doing? What could the dog possibly be doing? Ah! Rabbit, I'll murder you! I will kill you! Gee, 45, Jesus Christ. Oh, I should be stabbing enemies. Oh, my attack fell. I've been weak to that. I don't think Basil's in this forest. We haven't even searched the whole forest yet. We can't stop now. Cheer up, Aubrey. We'll keep searching until we find him. If we don't have to find Basil soon, maybe we should meet up with Mary from the playground and figure out what to do from there. Yeah, maybe, but first let me pick up this bee. Yeah, that's still perfectly normal item get sound that we love and is definitely a good thing. I give solid advice in exchange for clamps. What kind of advice would you like? Give me bad advice. Understood. Here's her advice. Don't be ugly. Hope this helps. 
It does. I'll work on it. Thank you very much, sir. I got what I paid for. Forest is so damn big. Train station. Squack, mine starts here. Mom told me to put on a jacket because she thought it was gonna get cold. It's so hot right now. But I don't wanna take my jacket off because I did all have to hold it. True. You know what I hate more than anything else? One wish in the world, I would destroy all the world's bunnies. Hey, you look like you've defeated a few bunnies. Yeah, that's right. I can tell how many bunnies you've defeated just by looking at you. That's how much I hate bunnies. Cool. Say, tell you what, let's make a deal. If you defeat at least five bunnies, come back and report to me. I'll give you something nice. Now go and destroy those bunnies. Okay. Hello, fellow buddy hater. I can see by looking at your eyes that you've killed four bunnies. Okay, I'll work on it. Oh boy, I'm in trouble now. Ugh, why does it always gotta be me? This ain't none of your business, kid. Be careful who you associate yourself with. I'm speaking from experience here. Hi, kids. I'm Gibbs, the stationary musician. I used to be a traveling musician, but then I left that life a long time ago. Would you be able to spare five clams? It would be a great help, but I'm complete since I'm completely stationary. I'll show you something good if you do. Sure, why not? Thank you for your donation. Now in return, let me play the song of my people. The song of your people is just Animal Crossing? <laughs> that guy in the left is jamming out. That's enough out of you. I, I said that's enough out of you. I want my money back. You thought the song was pretty good. I don't know that I did. Trains on really about thing. I'm just here for the video check. A long ass line. Who is this? I spy with my little eye, a little uh, a rainbow umbrella thing with lots of uh, legs. That's you. Howdy! Howdy! I like to consider myself a pretty well tempered Josh, but if there's one thing I can't stand, it's line cutters. Can you tell the guy in front of me to hurry up? Some of us have lives, you know? Howdy! True. This, that's a hot dog. Hot diggity dog. Hot diggity dog. It's me. A hot diggity dog. It is a blessing to exist. That's awesome. Good for you, man. Alright, I gotta kill another rabbit. Hey, speaking of. I'm a murderer! Wait, I should've, uh... uh I'm passing, I'm passing to someone. Oh. He's, he's hurt.
Get out of here, Sprout Mall. Why is every item inside a watermelon? That bunny's upside down. Hero, smack that ball! Oh, Kel's toast. I found candy. Good, because I need it. I have a toast in my party now. Bunny, but upside down. Why does it do that? It seems inconvenient. Its ear muscles must be really strong. Uh, so, ah! Rabbits! And they're mad. They're mad AF. What beats mad? Happy beats mad. Who makes us happy? I think it's, uh, Aubrey? Pep talk on morning. Uh, Kel snack. Stop making my attack fall. I'm trying to make my attack better. I'm happy too. Now I'm going to stab them. Oh, it looks fucking frightening when he's happy. Ow. That's a dead rabbit. We just did a loop. Ah! I don't want to deal with you right now. I want- Ah! That's fine. I'll kill- We'll kill some rabbits. What are they- They're- do they, Are they happy? Is there a way to tell what they are? I'm not seeing any specific thing. Um... For a deal with you. I'll go up there in a second. 
That's where the wise guy is. Oh, how do I get down there? There's a thing there, too. Levy! I did it! Hello, fellow bunny hater. Your ten bunny is splendid. To destroy more bunnies, that's ten bunnies of liberated. Thank you so much, fellow bunny hater. Got a cotton ball. I'm going to destroy more bunnies. How many? Fifteen more. Okay. What's the cotton ball? Three leaf clover. Just a regular clover. Three luck. One defense. Three special defense. Sure. Hector. He's a good friend. I, I can't take Hector away from him. That'd be so mean. What? Oh, I increased. Okay, I was I was confused. I was like, wait, why did why did giving her the clover decrease her luck? But it did not. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh, oh, he's uh, he's amazed. Is that a, as an art? Who's that? Hmm. That was probably fine. I'm sure that was good. Good and fine. I just get out of here. Ah, stay away from me. I don't want to deal with your bullshit. Damn rabbits. That's a sad rabbit. I'm gonna stab him. Not a dead rabbit. I really thought stabbing that rabbit would be enough. But it's gonna take if it's gonna take two anyways, it's pointless. You got three clams. Whatever, the more rabbits I kill the better. Seems a little upset. Oh, about that. Uh, well, you see. <sighs> Let me explain. Look at this poll. Can you believe it? That is a poll. It's true. Uh, what are we looking at? Yeah, I don't see it. Yeah, the, that's the point. You don't see it. Exactly. The tether ball is missing. Hello. Swung too hard now that the ball's gone far off somewhere. Never be seen again. I told you not to use your arms, man. You gotta use your head. Like this. Sorry, Burly. Using my head all the time gives me a headache. That's because you don't have a hard head like I do. Oh, something just hit me. It was you. You hit me with your head. This is an abusive relationship. Well, be lost forever. Eh, don't swallow it, Burly. We'll look for the ball for you. Hey, you sure you want to do that? Fast Forest is a pretty dangerous place, you know. One time, I even got in a super grizzly brawl with this ugly plant creature with dead, empty eyes and a gaping mouth. What? Now, yeah, would it, of course, be cool and smart and all? There's no monster or monster in all the universe that can outrun me. <laughs> uh, wait, what's that mirror? Say, Amori, why don't you and your friends go with Burly and keep her out of trouble? I'd go myself, but... Bang! Rose ran over bangs again! 
Oh. Oh, geez, there's my cute. I'm coming, Happy. They're always committing crimes, and I appreciate them for that. Come on, Burley, let's go find your lost call. We don't have anything to worry about as long as we're together. Heh, <laughs> sure, just don't get in my way when I show off my totally amazing headbutt skill. Ugh. Let's just get this over with. Burley joined your party. Okay, what's this? A floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Well, last time I looked in a mirror, good things happened, so I will be sure to keep doing that. Hello, everyone. How's it going? Have you found Basil yet? Hey, Mary. No luck so far, I'm afraid. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. I wish there was a way I could help you more. We're all doing our best. Uh, that's the plan, yeah? And I'm beating the game twice. I know there's the Tekikamori route as well, so I'm gonna do both of them. That's the plan! We should start looking outside the forest. Yeah, I know! Why don't we try climbing that really long ladder? The one east of the stump. We, we tried that. We, we can't. We can't do that. I'm already afraid of heights. What if Basil's somewhere up there? We gotta take our chances. I know, but... Amori, you're growing stronger and stronger every day. You can handle climbing a ladder, can't you? Come on, little brother. Face your fears. It's natural to be nervous at first, but you should know that we all believe in you. Come on, Amori. It's just one measly ladder. What's the worst that could happen? I could fall and break my neck and die. I don't know about this. Do you really think you're going to be okay, Amori? No! That's okay. You just take your time. Ah, come on, Amori. You can't just sit tight with Basil, Basil missing. Amori, we have to do this. We're all here to support you. If anything happens, we'll all, we'll all be here to protect you, too. Won't we, Aubrey? Yeah, I guess you're right about that. You have nothing to be afraid of as long as we're together. Basil is probably all alone. He needs us right now. Amori, you need to face your fears for Basil's sake. I believe in you. We can take it slow if you'd like, as long as we get there eventually. Woohoo! Let's go! Let's go to the ladder! Use the stuff! We'll see. We'll all see you later, Mary. Bye now. Stay safe. Remember, Amori, you're stronger than you think. No, I'm like level four, I think. Still haven't found that. One second. Eternal banana. All right. Uh, so we gotta find the friggin' a ball. Sure, I'll kill some bunnies, why not? Happy bunny! What beats happy? Angry? No, angry beats sad. Sad beats happy? I think sad beats happy. So you make... Uh, you make Kel sad. Everyone else just attack. Kel feels sad. With a booming attack. Just a tire swing. Are you sure? Are you sure about that? <laughs> Damn rabbits. Ah, it's so hard dodging shit. Uh, I'm gonna stab you. I'm gonna, we're gonna kill you. Don't 
wink at me. Food. Yum. Alright, let's kill this rabbit. Oh, wait, no. Let's kill this rabbit. Let's murder it for Leafy's sake. Right, where's this damn ball at? We still can't go up here, I assume. Is this somewhere in my lost ball one? You got somewhere else to be or something? No. Find your ball. Maybe the the place of the doghouse. Shelter. Nourishment. Small bone. Nothing. Where's this ball at? Oh wait, I need more, I need more bad advice. Hold on. In the wise rock. I want bad advice again. Understood, here's your advice. Listen to everyone's advice. I like the last one better, but that does help anyways. Thank you. Ah! Yeah, the ball's probably down there, if I had to guess. I don't know how to get down there. Can I just loop around this way? Easy enough. Oh, there it is. Sweet! There's my lost ball! Yoink! Finally! Let's take this bad boy to the playground. I'm just gonna play some tetherball. One second, I gotta see what this is. A hard ball. You can hear something struggling inside. Uh, okay. Good for it. Sure, I'll fight you guys, whatever. I will do a murder. Why not? Uh, you make him happy. Damn, Aubrey's taking it. Jesus Christ, Aubrey's about to become toast. You can do it! to me all the other three of them all of their group attacks are actually doing things with the group all of Amori's group attacks are just his own thing <laughs> this will certainly not be plot relevant got Jax okay, that that watermelon keeps changing color I want I want that one Certainly, Amori being the odd one out constantly would not mean anything. Uh, what's this bracelet do? Plus one defense? Sure, why not? Play some tetherball. See you later, alligators. I'm out of here. 
But seriously, come see me before you go. I got something special for you. Okay. I do need to talk to best guy, though. One second. <laughs> Thank you. Hey dudes, thanks for getting the lost ball back. As you can see, I'm putting it to good use. Yep, she sure is. More blunt force trauma to my head. I was thinking, since you're also kind of helping me out, I'm going to be generous and teach you my special skill. But first, I got a question for y'all. Which y'all has the hardest head? Probably Kel. Well, duh, that'd have to be Aubrey. What did you say? Whoa, chill out. No hard feelings. <laughs> Get it. <laughs> eh, that sounds about right. All right, Aubrey, I'm going to teach you a skill just between hard-headed folk like us. It's my specialty, head. It's simple, really. You just run up to someone and... Abuse them. Wham. Now you try. Do it to Kel. Do it to Kel. <gasps> that looks like it would hurt. And also mess up my hair. And also ruin my bow. Now oh, come on, Aubrey. Live a little. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> Heroes. Having messy hair never hurt anyone. Heroes. Let me prove for that. Uh, yeah, you bet. Hm, fine. But if I'm doing this, I'm giving it all I got. Oh, I thought you were going to do it to Kel. I feel dizzy. Wow, nice one, Aubrey. I knew I saw talent in you. Congratulations! You passed the test with flying colors. Uh, what's happening? From this day forth, I hereby declare you a bona fide headbutter. Aubrey learned headbutt. Now take the certificate. Show your friends. I'm sure they'll be proud. You got a butt certificate. I am proud of you, Aubrey. Lovely. We love a butt certificate. Alright. You have headbutt now. Deal big damage, but Aubrey also takes damage stronger when Aubrey is angry. I can make Aubrey fucking live it. So... Where's my, I need my, uh, my butt certificate. It's beautiful. It's fantastic. Burley the superintendent. Absolutely worth. Yes, some nutritious candy. This is the best heal sound in any game. Is our, uh, is our good friend back up here again? Nah. This song's got very Yuminiki vibes. I like it a lot. Oh, look at all the blood. Wait, why? Why are all Basil's footsteps bloody? Remember what Mary said, Amori. You're stronger than you think. Don't worry, we'll be right behind you. Yeah, and if you fall, we'll be right here to catch you. Don't, don't scare him. He won't fall, Amori. I promise. Amori the goat. Oh, boy. Or not Amori, I meant to say Aubrey the goat there. We love hands. I don't think we're doing this. I think Iron Hands is too scary. That shit's Katie is insane. You are no longer afraid of heights. Oh. Okay. I know there's a reason why we've never climbed this ladder, but I can't put my finger on it. It's on the tip of my tongue. Ah, oh, well, here goes nothing. Oh, we're not afraid of heights because we beat the, the we beat the, the 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 staircase demon in real life. Wait, hold up, guys. Uh, shoot, where is he? I just had him. Where is who? Hector, my pet bro- No! We lost Hector! No! No! 
Oh, Hector! Me too. Just have fallen out of my plug, but I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry, Hector. I should have been more careful. What's the big deal? It's just Aubrey. No. Aubrey, respect the rock. Don't you dare say that. He's not just a rock. He's family. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll turn up soon, Cal. Probably. Sure hope so. We're, 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 we're going back. No, we're, we're going back down for Hector. Fuck that. Where is Hector? Wait, this is actually so long. A regular rock. What? No! Hector, no! This is so sad. Where is he? Anybody seen Hector? You seen Hector Mirror? No. Damn. I hope we find Hector soon. He's really messed up. All right, back to the plot, I guess. Hector is missing. Hector is currently AWOL. Can we, hey, maybe we can draw a face on that one, Kel? Nah, I understand. You can't replace family. You can try, though. Need to find Hector. All right, all right, all right. I don't know where Hector would be, but all right. If the chat says Hector must be found, then Hector must be found. It's the only way. I didn't know it was. I wasn't even sure if it was a thing or not. All right, all right. We'll find Hector. We'll find Hector. Leave Hector? What is wrong with you? Why would you say that? After everything we've been through with Hector, you would just do this? Like me? That's a rock. I think we're still afraid of spiders because we haven't beaten the spider demon. Hector wouldn't be in the tree stump. Assuming we cannot go to white space. Oh, we can. Where could Hector possibly be? Hector's amazing. Eh. Hector's probably pretty good, so... Hector! Where are you? Hey Mary, have you seen Hector? I am Maureen Cliff Faces. You should, you should totally smile more. I've always liked your smile. All costs your love. Uh, yeah. Uh, tell me about Hector. Dang, Kel's pet. Rock Hector fell out of his pocket. Sorry, Kel, I'm not sure where he is, but don't give up. That's it? That's not helpful, Mary. Is he trying to get a crush on us over the fire puzzle? How cute. I think I saw Michael throw one up. Wait, oh, okay. Noted. You don't know where Hector is. No one knows where Hector is. Hector? Hector? No. Wait, can I? Can I go to bed? Comfortable looking bed. It's 
So does that eyeball dude just leave the black cracks in the ground everywhere? Uh, I mean, I'm enjoying the characters. I'm enjoying the general vibe. I'm a, I'm a big fan of sort of weird core stuff. And I'm, from what I understand, the game has a, a fair bit of it, which is nice. I'm not big on RPGs. <laughs> the main reason I've, I've not played this up until now is just because... RPGs aren't really my style, but you know, I can bear the RPG elements of it for everything else. I'm ready for it. I love to be messed up. I'm not afraid of heights, I can come up here now. Although I doubt the rock is up here. Oh. See. I see what you did there. Just a boy with his kite. We may not look like much, but we have an unbeatable bond. It's not something just anyone would understand. We'll show you how strong we are when we work together. Oh. Okay. Kid's kite. Let's fuck up his kite. Drool! Kill is almost toast! Uh, how much health does it have? Okay, it's at half. Okay, so... <laughs> 9 out of 10 dentists eat it. Uh, yeah, let's give an apple juice to Cal. Okay. Hope 
hopefully this doesn't send me back too far. What? I'm a fool! That give it back all its health. Oh my god. Thank you, Pick! I think we I think we just lose. Aha! As the wind predicted, me and my kite are unbeatable. Oh, is Twitch doing that? That's so cool of Twitch. Game over. Shit, I don't know what our last save was. Do you want to retry? Not really. I don't think we win those. I mean, actually, well, maybe. If we kill the kid first... Uh, if I can make the kid sad... Yeah, he's happy. But now he's sad. What an idiot. Three damage. Jeez, okay. Alright, now let's stab this child, as you do. I didn't know that. Kite kids got so much HP. I don't think we win these. Oh, now we're doing a lot more damage than actually. The sadness really. really messed him up. Although now he crits very frequently. I can potentially make the kite sad? I don't know if that does anything. He still has so much HP though. Ha, <laughs> you missed, idiot!
No, oh, that was a mistake. Game over. No. Please don't send me back too far. <laughs> Shit, okay, this is gonna take me, I don't remember what the last thing we did was. Do we have headbutt? Yeah, we do have the butt certificate. Stop getting handsy with me. I don't afraid of you no more. We will actually make it to the top this time. so uncareful that we like went and did a whole other thing and died. Who was this? Dinosaur? We like underground? On the moon first. Come on, hero, step it up. Oh, the ladder, it's just never ends. <laughs> That's one small step for Skell and one large step for Kelkine. That's not how it goes. You don't get to decide how it goes. You weren't here first. Wait, hold on. Is that my butt certificate? Take that thing down right now. What if somebody sees it? No way. Look at this thing fluttering in the wind. So majestic. So beautiful. Hero, do something. Uh, one sec. Uh, just... It's in my breath. Actually... Give me a minute. Oh. Fly the butt certificate in Cattail Field. Aubrey's butt certificate is so majestic. So beautiful. So are we on the moon now? Cheap. Another world camp today. Cheap, cheap. Cattail Field. very expensive. A floating mirror, your friends smile warmly behind you. One of these days they won't. 
Hello, sir. This guy looks pretty intimidating. Yeah. Oh. Not even any dialogue, just right into it, huh? Okay. Right arm, left arm? Uh, sure, why not? Let's beat up his arms, maybe he can't hurt me. Oh, I hit the main guy. Yo, this track kind of slaps, though. Each of his arms has a hit. Oh, all of his oh, his stats went up. It's time for an ultimate attack, though. Get fucked, bro. Oh, that's all it took, baby. Slice? I can slice bread now? Or I can throw a slice of bread. 
Okay, sure, why not? <laughs> Red Slice. If this skill defeats a foe, gain bread. Okay, <laughs> sure, why not? Centaur, first place. Miniest centaur, first place. Can, can I, I want to go past you. Tiniest centaur, first place. Itty bitty centaur, first place. Littlest centaur, first place. Littlest centaur, first place. Small centaur. You are great at this. Okay, so it's a little dusty. Let's fight a dust bunny. Why does this song slap so hard? Oh, he's dead. Okay, so it's a little dusty. Cheap, other world like, cheap, cheap, other world campsite, cheap, cheap, junkyard. Oh, goodness, am I in your way? I'm so sorry, I'm a fofa. that way. Okay, there's like a thing down here, right? There we go. Thank you, Vlanks. Big TB. Often, you know. Oh, hey, while you're here, could you be a real pal and help me get the stuff that's on this list? Did you get all that? Everything you need should be in the junkyard. Thanks, buddy. I owe you one. Huh? What do you mean it was too fast for you to read? <sighs> Fine. Here's a list you can look at for as long as you want to. What should we call it? Do hickey and thingamabob on it? No problem. You got a strange list. Got it down this time. I expect I'll be seeing you again soon. Thank you. <coughs> but, oh, that's a... Is that a wormhole? It's a fucking wormhole, isn't it? Who are these fellers? We're explorers. Oh, space bunny? <laughs> I love the variations on the battle theme. Let's fuck this rabbit up, Amori. It, the, the space rabbit was spacing out. I, I get it. I understand the joke. you then. Shiny telescope. Let's check out the view. There's a spider. 
I think I'm scared of those. Wait, I see the melon. There were fries in my melon. Is that an enemy? A lonely crow gets the dirt. It doesn't seem to notice you. I don't know if I should be over here right now. Ah! Oh, I guess I left. Is this like a go to? Is 2D game? 2D James? Got cardboard. <laughs> Greetings, traveler. Welcome to my home. It is humble and small, but it is mine. Broke your ship. Sorry about that. This gravel is super glued to the wall. Dead batteries. Got a cane. Many sprout bulbs just would have this place, but a lot of them moved away to merge with the bigger colonies around the big forest. It was a risky move, so some of us stayed behind. My brother left for the rest of the sprout bulbs. Do you think he still remembers me? No. I might have killed him. But that's okay. Don't worry about it. What is cardboard? Is that an equipment? Give to recycle machine for 15 clams. Okay. Computer part. Very big TV. My friends used to live in these tunnels, but they all left to look for their missing later. Do you think they'll ever come back here? Y'all got so much power down here. Is that the most horse? These bravels are highly intelligent creatures. Most horse, I knew it. This sprout mole is the most horse. That's centaur. Out of his league. Okay, I would like to avoid that. If, that is a plane. Is a barn. Doors locked. There's another crow. I don't know if I should be here. Hello. Wow, miss, you sure are tall. Thank you, little one. It's more most it's more of a hassle most of the time, but I do get to be better to do the stores. What? Being tall isn't a hassle. Everything's better when you're tall. One day I'm gonna be as tall as you. Yeah, sure, Cal. Keep dreaming. Starfruit soda. Inside a watermelon. Huh? A quest? Schmorge. Uh, strange enough. Thank you for having the time to talk to me. I apologize, but I'm afraid I'm about to with a task I cannot complete with my own capabilities. Quite recently and suddenly, a rogue planet burst across the sky in an alarmingly fast pace. My three dearest friends panicked and flew off in separate directions. My three friends approached you see, another most friendly and all welcoming creatures. A bit weird as such an immense favor from a complete stranger, but there are many past rumors fields. May I ask, would you be willing to help me find my dear friends? I'll thank you straight enough. Of course, you can see, without them, I am just a stick in the mud. I get it. I understand the joke. I've seen two of your friends, but, but what is that? Is a what is happening up here? Who is this feller? Shoot, I know I left my donut somewhere around here. I'm gonna fight some goofos. Ah! Kills being abducted. Fuck 
como... How is he not dead? Okay, I was gonna say he should definitely be dead. Counter. Ah, I found your donut. Uh, okay. Why did you why did you leave your donut inside of a watermelon? Why did the scarecrow win an award? Because he was outstanding. Actually, pretty good. <laughs> it's always good to ask some jokes on hand. If only you had a joke book to write them down. And if only, man! Isn't this guy beautiful? It's nice to know there's so many others out there who share the same view. You got a mango smoothie. No. Leave, leave, leave me alone. I got crows. I got crows. Crows, crows, crows! Perhaps if you were someone more charming? What? Damn, okay. See how it is. Yeah, you don't just gotta say it to my face, but... Heal me up. to bother you, but have you seen my son anywhere? We looked for him in, uh, We have looked away for less than a second. He's gone and ran off again. You can keep an eye out for me. You know when you see him. He looks just like me. Haha. Uh -huh. His family records everything. Alright, I'll look for your kid. No promises, though. The place used to be a pristine wildlife reserve, but due to the recent boom in tourism, it's starting to accumulate a lot of trash. Take up your trash, people. It's not that hard. Hi, I'm Pessy, and as you probably noticed, I love Sweetheart! I got every piece of merchandise she's ever released. I got Sweetheart posters, figures, stickers, shirts, her entire discography, anything else you can think of. I am certain you won't find a more thorough collection anywhere else in the world. Calling me a super fan is an understatement. I am the ultimate fan! Let me tell you about the time I almost met Sweetheart. We just happened to be eating at the same restaurant. It was fate, I think. We ordered the same meal, too. Not like I totally saw what you ordered a computer or anything. I should turn up my mic a bit? Thank you. All right, we'll do. But I just bought a newly really Sweetheart life size statue the other day and early in Queen Forty, which I guess will end up being a good thing since that girl turned out to be some regular girl wearing a costume that kind of looked like Sweetheart's anyway. Not like you can tell in the first place. Only a poser fan would ever mistake a regular person for Sweetheart. Alright, let me know if that's any better. Surprisingly normal bed. <laughs> A table full of merchandise for an obnoxious looking person. True. You got a can! A recycling machine just gave me a cool prize for some cans. Recycling does pay off. You put a can in the recycling machine. Thank you for letting me know. <laughs> Going for three hours. Nobody, nobody thought. It's fine. Uh, pump it up. Do that. Twenty clams. Damn. All right. No, you're good. 
I'm just surprised. I guess everyone else thinks I sound fine, so it's fine. I'm a little louder now. Hopefully, it's better. The band of space pirates have been camping out here for a long time now. I hear the captain suddenly decided he wasn't going to travel anymore, so I have the crew took a ship and left. Hello, children. You are now entering the vicinity of the captain of the space pirates, the master of the solar system, and prince of the universe. The one and only captain of space. I mean, uh, you entered the house of space uh, boyfriend. Whoa, the captain of the space pirates lives here. That's awesome. I want to be a space pirate too. Yeah, well, so did I once, and I took an arrow to the knee. Space boyfriend doesn't do much these days, so most of the space pirates got fed up and left with the main ship. It's just us stragglers down here doing all our space boyfriend's chores and whatever. Used to be in the gorge, spending their cleaning and throwing away all his trash. <sighs> I didn't leave my old job for this. I ain't no babysitter. Oh, I'm sorry, that sounds awful. Yeah, maybe we could talk some sense to him? No, oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Yeah, Captain Space... I mean, uh, Space Boyfriend's got to sidestep, you see. We should at least try. You never know. I, he might know something about how to find Basil. Or maybe he knows where to find my pet rock Hector. Y yeah, sure, that too. What are we waiting for? Let's go see him already. Sorry about your job, sir. It'll get better s soon, I promise. Thank you, little lady. I sure hope so. Squack? I guess it's been so boring around here ever since Captain's- I mean, Space Boyfriend took charge of the Space Pirates. I mean, look at what Space Boyfriend's done to the old Captain's ship. Captain Pinkbeard would never approve of this. Oh, the view here is spectacular! Buddy. It sucks that you had to come at a time like this. Space boy friend, what can we do for you, bro? Why won't you leave your bed? All I hear lately is that the rest of the crew are complaining about being bored. Am I the only one who enjoys cleaning around here? <laughs> Things around are a little tough now, but I don't care what anyone says, pal. I believe in the camp. Bro's depressed as hell? Yeah, Maury, you hit them notes. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Uh-oh. Captain Sp I mean, Space Boyfriend doesn't look so good. Don't worry, I'll handle this. Hey, Space Boyfriend, wake up! Kel! What? <coughs> Oh. <clears throat> Precious sweetheart. Aw, he sounds so sad. There must be some way to help him. <clears throat> oh, my sweetheart. Where have you run off to now? Oh, no, not again. Space boyfriend's feeling the heavy blues. Hey, my boy, I should cheer you right up. Why ain't anything playing? He lost his mixtape? What's wrong with you? It was fire! The boombox is empty! He's never gonna wake up now! Or even worse, he's gonna wake up angry. Oh man, oh man! Where could that special mixtape be? Someone must have thrown away a special mixtape when we were cleaning! What's the big deal? It's just a cassette, right? Well, you see, whenever Space Boyfriend's away from Sweetheart, he gets really sad and lies in bed all day. The only way to snap him out of it is by playing a special mixtape. There's only one in the universe like it. Oh, I see. Space Boyfriend isn't sick. He's lovesick. Ugh. Space Boyfriend stays like this. The once great coalition of space pirates will be lost for eternity. Oh. Man. That sucks. Well, let's go! Wait, where are you going? We should help him out. You know, it really sucks to lose something important to you. Don't you dare bring Hector into this. I'm talking about when you stole my stuffed toy. Huh? I don't remember anything like that. <sighs> oh, Star, my perfect goddess. Uh, he's simp? He's a simp? Sweet jelly-filled donut. He's a simp. I think he's getting worse. What should we do, Amori? Help him? I 
guess. Throwing smoke boys, I really appreciate it. Yeah, take this. You got junkyard key. This key unlocks the junkyard. The special mixtape should be somewhere in there. You can get that through the secret entrance to Space Boyfriend's backyard. Pretty convenient, eh? Why? Why is his backyard like this? <gasps> is that Pluto? <laughs> is that fucking Pluto? We've really done it now, dude. I hope the captain won't be too mad at us when we tell him his favorite planet is missing. You know how he gets when he's angry. Buddy, you're not supposed to call him captain anymore. You have to call him space boyfriend, remember? Oh yeah, that's right. You know, dude, sometimes I wonder if we're even space pirates anymore. Ever since that sweetheart came along, we haven't done anything cool. We should just quit and get real jobs. Don't talk nonsense, buddy. What is life if not for the space pirate life? I'm sure the captain will come to his senses one day and we'll all fly again. We just have to believe in him. Thanks, dude. You're always there when I need you. That is the bromance I want to see. That was the fucking dude I fought. Can I get these bananas? No. I'm gonna fight a wormhole. It is a wormhole. I'm glad. Fuck him up. Let's, let's attack him twice. He's singing. He opens up a wormhole. Ah, oh, goddammit. Bro's living those? Jesus, got actually got a fair bit of health. Say, bro, better die. <laughs> that should be enough for the UFO, yeah. Clams. That should be a piece of equipment, right? Backpack. Plus two defense. I think that's straight up better than what Shiro has. Actually, does Kelly even have an equip? Because he lost Raw. My good men, I am looking for some art. Fear not, fear I will know when I found it. That's cool. Lovely weather, isn't it? Oh, he actually stood out of my way this time. He's, he's done being an asshole. <laughs> Junkyard. Zero keys. Oh boy. Gotta find a special mixtape in here. I got a granola bar! Yippee! So this is the junkyard, eh? Time to start digging! What are we looking for again? Space Boyfriend Special Mixtape. right -o. Hey look, I found a can! You got a can. <sighs> Guess that's a start. Bottle. There's an angry mixtape up there. Or down there. Air horn. 
Kel is digging through trash. Finds a piece of tofu. Cool. Let's fuck up this mixtape! Bob. Oh, I needed that. Aw, oh, man, looks like there's a big block of junk in the way. You might even call it a roadblock. Get it? I do get it. Thank you, hero. Not to worry, everyone. This big old block is nothing compared to my swing. Hey, Mori, you know you can cut roots and traffic cones. Well, you're not the only one with a special ability around here. I, for one, can smash large blocks out of the way. Kill and Hero have their own special abilities, too. Although I'm not so sure about Kill. <laughs> Just make me the leader by selecting tag in the player menu or by holding R. I'll get rid of this hunger junk. Easy peasy. Oh, that's how I would get the crows. Wait, what is the button? Can you repeat that? Or by holding A. You tagged Aubrey. Bop! Oh, hell yeah. Now, I guess I need to go talk to those crows with, uh, probably Hero. You got a can. Glass bottle. Yeah, okay, let's fuck up this dialect computer. Canned bread. Kel, why are you always digging through? You find us tofu, I'm not gonna complain. Dunk on him! Unfortunately, they both survived this turn. Oof. Hero hurts himself in frustration. Oh, because the dial up is slow. Okay. Sure. Okay, that was enough to kill it. Jeez. Kel, don't hurt yourself that much. That's messed up. You kill some health. Tofu fundraiser. Everyone's speed fell. Brother! You die! I like to joke about the scarecrow. That was funny. I wish I had a joke book to write it down. Chocolate! Flower puzzle. Oh! I needed that. I need a key for this. The gate is locked. Hey, Mr. Conveyor Bot! Switch up those conveyors for us already. <laughs> Rude person. You can't just yell orders at people, Kel. That, then your name would be Yell, not Kel. Jeez, have some tact, will you? Now, now, there's no need to fuss. I'll handle this one. Tag me, Amori. We're learning about tagging. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Greetings, Sir Conveyor Bot. My companions and I require your assistance in changing the directions of your conveyors. Will you and your friends please help us? Ah, uh, mm, nice person. Okay. Damn, hero. You really had it in you. I'm here for it. Is that a toilet? You got ramen. I don't know about the toilet ramen. 
I think we should reconsider that one potentially. Comet Hammer. Glasses Ghost looks around aimlessly as if it's lost. Who holds Hammer? Is it Aubrey? Comet Hammer. Oh, that's quite a bit better. Mr. Plant Egg makes a weird noise when you punch it. Flip him for me. Oh, we're taking a long time to go back, huh? Okay, what's my best way of getting around? I can just go around. Please do a switchy for me. Ah! Uh, that's the... That's the Kool-Aid, man. Hey, Paige! I'm the Life Jam guy! I show Life Jam! It's kind of a spoiler for a not necessary... I mean, sure. I mean, if it's not a, like, story spoiler, that's fine. It really works! Would you like a free demo? Okay. Oh, I've taken some hits already. I- oh! Oh! Use life jam, it really works! You got life to- oh. <laughs> life Jam guy explains the benefits of Life Jam. Okay. Samples. Goodbye now, haha. <laughs> yeah, can you like do? Am, okay. How would you like my free demo? Haha. <laughs> I'm kidding. I know you loved it. Oh, I see you are still hurt. No worries. I will heal you up. He's the goat. Life Jam Man is the goat. He only had to murder me first. Very good. Yes. Now, would you like to buy some Life Jam? It'll only cost you 250 clams. That's less than it would cost me elsewhere. So sure. You got life gem. And how could I say no to a man this kind that would murder me? I would have to be a fool. Let's get that key. Switch for me, please. Thank you. I'm gonna have to... I still need two of the things for TV girl. Photo of someone familiar. Got a life jam. Uh, they just th they just throw those out. They just chilling out here. Yeah, sure. I'll fight a mixtape. Why not? Thank you, Kel. Will this be enough to murder him in turn one? Oof! That's a hit, baby. Nice. 
I don't want to deal with that guy. Lemonade. Oh, big turkey. Chicken, turkey, whatever. A can. What did I need? I needed... I still need two of these three things. Hopefully I find them. That's an angry mixtape. Sure, I don't think we fought one of these yet. Oh, that's a whole ass boombox. That's a doom box! Uh, what beats angry that would be... Happy? Yeah, happy. Uh, who does happy? You do happy, okay. Um, let's do that. You pep talk. Hell. Seven and learn to mock. Mock deals damage if the foe's angry, greatly reduce its attack. Okay. Um. Ignores defense when Amori is sad, not the enemy. I'm stupid. I was doing it the wrong way. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Um, deals damage. Reduces attack. That could be pretty useful. I mean, there's especially some... Yeah, sure. Let's do that. I have yet to use the guard on Amori anyways. Computer part. Kel is digging through trash. Of course. Of course, Kel is. Okay, that's happy. If it's happy, I want to hit it with angry. Kel makes things angry. It makes people angry. Uh, annoying. Her. Uh, you. Honestly, just attack for now. Oh no, not my speed. Hey, 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 Aubrey. Hey, Aubrey, get mad. Hey, Aubrey, get mad. Fuck that mixtape up. It's out of here. Hero tag. That fella up there. Hello. 
over. Kick, 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 kick over. Alright. Sounds fair to me. Ow, what the? What gives? What do you know? There's a weak point on his head. I can recognize one of those anywhere. Let's try throwing something at it. I'm sure that'll work. That platform there looks like a good place to throw from. Tag me, I got this. Oh, that explains what the uh, the thing was from before. You tag kill. Big place with the kite. I'm gonna go back and fuck up that kite kid. He did a number on me. Kel tagged you. All the pictures are so nice. Got a can. Got a poetry book. Is there anything down there? Besides the mixtape? Yeah, there is. I was digging through the trash. Okay, that one is sad. Let me try this out and see how, how it works. Sad, angry beat sad, Kel's our anger man. Wait, no. You're going to attack that one. You're going to annoy Andre, Aubrey. And, uh, yeah, you just hit. Hey, 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 hey! You're gonna, you're gonna stab this man in the face. Right to the heart. You can do better than that. I'll show you! Enraged! Damn, Aubrey's taking some hits. Last bottle. I'd like to avoid you if possible. I don't think it's happening. Oh, we did it! Oh, fatty! Screw you. Oh. So much shit in here. Rubber band. This place is so big. A doohickey. Okay, that's two out of three. We're getting there. Stuff root soda. It's no good. Even I can't dent this thing. Hmm. Hold on a sec. This is cheese, isn't it? Whoa, you're right. It is cheese. Okay, guys. Hear me out. This might sound crazy, but what if we eat the cheese? If we all start now, we could probably finish this in a couple hours or so. Just a warning though, cheese gets me kinda gassy. Bro, you weren't drinking milk and you're lactose intolerant? The most relatable character in the game. The most relatable character of all time, lactose intolerant, still consumes dairy. <laughs> Ew, Kel! Oh, hold up, Kel, there's no need for that. I think I may have the perfect solution. Tag me, Amori, I know just how to handle this. 
brother is going to sweet talk the cheese? Friends, it's me, EMS, the humble, hungry, the humble, hungry hamster. Oh, wow, is this all for me? What a treat! How did you know that cheese is my favorite? Uh, I don't have to guess, EMS. Everything is your favorite. Everyone, this is Emily, the hamster, but I just call her EMS. She's a good friend of mine. You know what? You know what to do, Ems. Sure do. Be done with me. How that even fit in her body? Beats me. I try not to think about it. That was incredibly satisfying. If you ever in need of a giant cheese eating services again, you know who to call. Goodbye, friends. Okay. That was weird. Give me the donut. How are we supposed to find anything in here? There's just way too much junk. Wait, were we looking for something? Oh, at long last, I finally found it. After countless hours of digging and digging, this one-of-a-kind ultra-exclusive special mixtape finally belongs to me. Rosa, the number one sweetheart fan in the world. With this one-of-a-kind addition to my collection, I will finally surpass all those lame poses out there. Wait. Oh, no. This special mixtape, it smells like doo-doo. Oh no, it's, I smell like doo-doo. Well, hold on, did she say she found a special mixtape? That's what we've been looking for. Oh yeah. Let's, get, let's go get it. I can hear everything you're saying, you know. Just as I suspected owning something so valuable is already getting me into trouble. Oh ho 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 ho. What's the matter? Are you jealous? This special mixtape is mine. I'll never give it to you, not now, not ever. What if we murder you? Hey, we didn't come out all the way out here for nothing. If you don't give us that special mixtape, we'll have to take it by force. Eek! Savage behavior! <laughs> Violence haven't solved anything, you know! It's solved most of the fights in this game. Except for the Life Jam one. Life Jam solved that one. <laughs> I'm much too refined for this nonsense. Farewell, peons. See you never! Wait, come back here! Hurry, Amori, after her. We can't let her get away! You'll never catch me, stick legs! You got a can! Hurry, Mori after her. We need that special mixtape. No, I need the other things. What? TV rope. Oh wait, this is the start? You and your friends feel like you. You gotta watch my call. That's all three, baby. I'm still in the prologue? What the fuck? Do not cross. Hmm. 404. Rosa, we finally caught you. Now give us that special mixtape. What's with her? Hey Rosa, can you hear us? Huh? I wonder why she isn't I wonder why she isn't responding. Let's take a closer look. I don't know if we should. Seems like a bad idea. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay! Oh, the fucking background, yes. I thought about using this music in my campaign, but I haven't found a place yet. Download window. Let's fuck him up! Uh, if I make him... If I... If I'm happy... No, if I'm sad... 
I want to make him happy. So let's do that. Let's make... Okay, we'll... we'll, we'll yeah, let's run this from the, from the top. Let's set poem ourselves. Pep talk. The download window. You guys just attack. You can do it! Download window feels happy! Download window's at 99%. Mori, you stab that. Uh, you start attacking. Hit it right in the heart. Oh, damn, okay. Download window is still at 99%. Let's keep stabbing him. Surely that will help. Just happened. Who cares? We gotta take back that special mixtape. You took the special mixtape from Rosa. Huh? What in the world? Hey, that's mine. Get it back. No way. It's Finders Keepers. We're putting this back in Space Boyfriend's boombox where it belongs. Mm -hmm. Space Boyfriend, you say? <laughs> you, you ignorant child. Haven't you heard the latest news? I have a very reputable source who tells me that Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart have long since parted ways. Why do you think the special mixtape is in the junkyard in the first place? It's because Space Boyfriend threw it away himself. Space Boyfriend threw away the special mixtape himself? Uh-oh, that's not good. But if Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart aren't together anymore, how will we ever wake up Space Boyfriend now? The future of the once great coalition of space pirates is depending on us. Hm, that sounds like your problem, not mine. Wait just a second! How do we know you're not lying about all this? You could just be trying to get the special mixtape back. Well, I... Never! I may be rude and pretentious, but I'm not a liar! I think we trust you. I think we'll just keep the special mixtape and see for ourselves. Now scram, you ugly plant creature. Go bother someone else. Oh my, so rude. You'll pay for this stupid boy! Mark my words! I can't believe Rose is the final boss. That's insane that they would do that. Uh, 
Oh. You know what? That tracks. <laughs> that actually very much tracks. Gold watch? Who would that be for? I would lower my speed a bit, but that's actually not bad. Is there anyone who would actually benefit from... not bad. Actually, I think Hero just gets a pure benefit from that. Yeah. Actually gets a pure benefit from that as well. Let's do that. Yep. Want our healer to have some hit points. I'm not dealing with the wormhole right now. Hold it right there! We finally found you, Pluto! There's no escape! Oh no. My gigantic, well-defined arms and legs are coming out. I can't let it end like this. I need to find a hiding place. Hey, you there! <sighs> Please, let me your assistance. Huh? Uh, oh, well, uh, er... Hurry! I don't have much time! Need a place to hide, huh? Jump in the pole. Aha, I got it. You can rest easy now. I got this all under control. That means nothing is under control. <laughs> okay, that's what I thought. Okay, that should do it. Shoot, they're coming. Quick, everyone, act natural. <sighs> Dang it, where are them? Hey, you kids, we're looking for a high-profile, very expensive rogue planet named Pluto. He's a big, circular, grayish guy with huge balls and muscles. Kinda hard to miss. Have you seen him? Uh... Um... <laughs> no, can't say we have. Really? Well, that's life. Come on, dude. Let's keep searching. We'll find him eventually. Okay, sir, the coast is clear. <laughs> Such quick thinking, I'm impressed. You have my eternal gratitude. What are your names, if I may ask? I'm Hero, and these are my friends, Aubrey Kalanamori. Oh, I see. Fine names for fine young people. My name is Pluto, and I am a rogue planet. A vagabond, if you will. I do apologize for causing everyone so much trouble. But I feel it's not my purpose to act as a mere yard decoration. I want the freedom to roam the sky as I please, like the birds and the stars. If that makes me a rogue planet, then so be it. They can call me what they please, so long as I'm free to do as I please. I'm rooting for Pluto. Love this guy. My soul yearns for freedom! You understand, don't you, children? Whoa, Kel, are you crying? <laughs> this is raw emotion! I'm touched! That was beautiful, Pluto! You said it, Kel! Wait, you too, Aubrey! Now, at long last, I am finally free to follow my lifelong dream of running my own transportation company! I'm gonna call it Pluto Spaceline. <laughs> this realization has reinvigorated me, and since you have helped me in such a selfless way, I must return the favor. Ahem. I am Pluto of Pluto Spaceline now. Please pretend you have just arrived at a transportation station. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, hello? Pluto? Greetings from Pluto Spaceline! Where would you like to go today, young travelers? Ah! Oh, was that too much? Hmm. Let's try it down and down. Let's try this again. Yeah, one second. Your voice heard. Ah! Shit. I get a sip of water. So I continued doing your gravelly voice, and then it decided to go everywhere. Ah. 
it was too in, it was too invigorated by Pluto. The speech. No, it's okay. We'd just like to go back to the campsite, please. So you want to go to the other world campsite? Ah, oh, my first request. How exciting! Oh no, here it comes. <laughs> One ride from the world campsite coming right off. I won't let you down, young travelers. Leave the rest to me. Is everyone strapped in? Wait, hold on, I'm not ready yet. <laughs> Greetings and welcome to Pluto Space Line. Where will your journey take you today? So you want to go to the other world? You got it. Now just sit back, relax, and enjoy the ride. How was that for a smooth ride? Comfortable environment and relaxing music. I'd give it five out of five stars. <laughs> Says you. I can't even feel my arms anymore. Get all I have to say. You did a great job holding on for dear life back there. You have the potential to be very strong. Let me teach you a skill that might be useful in the future. Ahem. Repeat after me. When I flex, I feel my best. Now you try. When I flex, I feel my... best? Whoa, that felt amazing, I'm pumped! Mm, could use a little work, and less. You've definitely got the power within you. Take this lesson and use it well. Farewell, children! Until next time! Keller and Flex, he's amazing. I love him. <laughs> I love him so much. Kel deals more damage next turn and increases hit rate for his next attack. Okay. All right. I hope it's more than double, because otherwise that's fucking useless. I mean, I guess increased hit rate. You could make him happy, and then that would, like, cancel out the happy debuff. So maybe that's actually not too bad. Basically, Aud Aubrey would pep talk him. He would flex himself, and then you get some big damage. A floating mirror. Everyone's here. I got some things for you. Oh sweet, you found everything on my list. I should ask more random I should ask random people for favors more often. Do 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 and voila That hits the spot. That was all just spent coffee. No, the coffee machine broke like forever ago, but I've been too busy to gather the missing parts. Now that this new one is all fixed up, I don't have to drink that gross instant coffee crap anymore. Here's a little something for helping me out. You got dynamite. This actually looks kind of dangerous. Hmm, okay. Now if you'll excuse me, I have some important business to attend to. Uh, you just, you just gave me dynamite? Deals heavy damage to all folks. Okay. Can I get some coffee too? Congratulations! Your coffee is ready. Can I just you are now brewing coffee. It will be ready after this commercial break. Sure, why not? Wait, I just realized those two guys I never spoke to. I need to go speak to those two guys. that I'm reminded that the universe is beautiful. Okay. Fair enough. Let's save just in case. We did a thing. Uh, 
I found someone who thinks they're more of a super fan than you. I am busy, as you probably noticed, I love sweetheart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just the same dialogue. Cool. Very cool story. I'm leaving. Hey, you kids really did it. It's a little dirty, but that is our mission special mix team for sure. Thanks a lot, my guy. With this, we'll finally be able to wake up Space Boy for it. Don't reach into your pocket to get a special mixtape. Actually, about that, uh, we might have some bad news. You heard a rumor that Space Boyfriend and Sweetheart, well, they broke up. What? what, what? Did they really? For real this time? Oh, no. But that would mean... But there's no point in playing in the special mixtape anymore. All hope is lost. Hey, Space Boyfriend, we got your special mixtape back. Hmm, you can at least thank us. Oh, don't be so down, Space Pirate Guy. It's just a rumor, and even if it is true, it's not the end of the world. People get over breakups all the time. I'm sure Space Boyfriend will be back on his feet soon. He just needs some time to readjust. Oh, I know. I'll blast his special mixtape on his boombox. He's got to wake up to that. In that case, we should probably get rid of that special mixtape after all. Listening to the songs might be way too emotional for him. Give it here, Amori. I'll keep it safe. Hey, k k k k Kel, Kel, k k Kel, Kel, Kel has it though. Huh, where is it? Kel. Kel, what are you doing? No! Wakey, wakey, space boyfriend! Uh oh. I've got a bad feeling about this. What is that infernal rocket? Darn it, Kel, look what you did. <laughs> Fair before I ever wake up. Hmm. One second. Oh, hell yeah! Wait, this Bob? <laughs> Much better! Now, where was I? Ah, yes! Foolish children! I must thank you for bringing me out of that pathetic state. I grew tired of lying in bed pretending to be sick. Like I always say, feelings are for losers! That wench, sweetheart. She's going to pay for leaving me. I did everything for her. I gave everything to her. He is a simp. Holy shit. Everything, you hear me? Not ungrateful, little. Uh. Oh, he just shot his bed. Just forget it. Forget everything. I'm gonna find sweetheart. I'm gonna make her pay. Uh, sorry, but we can't let you do that, space boyfriend, or should I say, space ex boyfriend. Oh, shit. Get him. Interesting. You want to challenge me? Do you even know who I am? I am the captain of the space pirates. I control all the planets of the solar system, and have the ability to fly through space at will. The power of the entire universe is at my command. Blah, blah, blah. Talk all you want. We're not scared of you. If you plan on going around causing trouble, you're going to have to go through us first. Hmm. So that's how it's going to be. If you still insist on stopping me, I'm afraid we'll just have to settle this the hard way. I'll take you all on. Fight me, earthly scum! Alright. Alright, let's start with a sad poem on Amori. Uh, and let's, uh, pep talk Kel. Uh, Kel, you flex up. And Hero, just hit. 25 damage. That's pretty big. Oh, yeah! Amari, right, you are... stabbing? Aubrey... 
do a right hit. Back hell, do you have anything special? Or uh, happy? What does happy mean? Happy means angry. I could make him angry. I should have made him angry first. Eh, it's fine. Wait, no. Sad beats happy. I could make him happy here. Yeah, hold on. If I make him happy, and then you attack, and then you attack. Oof. The big, the big everybody hit. Space ex-boyfriend is happy. Call Aubrey, give Aubrey some help. Stab this man once more. Damn, he's got a lot of health, shit. First, a foe targets hero for one. I don't want that. Shit. Right in the heart. Okay, nice big heal. I do not have enough for another stab. Happy is strong. Yeah, okay, so this is fine. Um, you do a hit. Everyone can probably just attack this turn. Shit, he's got a lot of health. My rage cannot be contained. You cannot black hate me. Oh, he's mad now. He can no longer become happy or sad. Oh, okay. Uh, what beats angry? Angry beats sad, so happy beats angry. So now Kel's doing more. Um. Alright, so attack with Amori. You're gonna pet taunt. Uh, you hit. You just hit. Miss! Dang it! Mori's happy. <laughs> Still looks so freaking creepy. Uh, you go ahead and make. You're you're just gonna stay depressed. You're just being depressed over there. Everyone else is gonna focus on dealing damage. You'll be items. Pop them. That hurts. Okay, um, alright, we're hitting, you start snacking, what can we snack on? I only have one prize. I think I mainly need to heal. Kel here. Honestly... Rebound do. Deals damage to all foes. It's not particularly useful. Uh, sure. Yeah, let's do that. And then you can cook for yourself. Miss! Oh, yeah! Okay, that was a good cook. Alright. Cut. Do we want to heal Aubrey? We leave it for now. Ah. 
Nice! Good damage. Aubrey's still impressed. Yeah, she does that. Ah, how are you still moving? Hi. I want the to feed me. Came enraged. Okay, um, you honestly heal up the Mari here. Kel hit. Okay, that's some good damage. Ooh, jeez, okay. Aubrey's out of the game. Kel is sad. No, that's not okay. I want Kel to be happy. Shit. Okay, we're still at eight. I need more. Uh, for Kel. I'd really like to hit ten here. I'm only at nine. Do I need everybody to be alive for the big attack? I probably do. For Malabar, 60 heart. I don't know that I need that much. Ooh! Furious. Okay, everyone's alive. Now I just need a Mori to attack here before the boss, and I think we win. There we go! Release it! Release the energy! Destroy him! That's terrifying. Let's not give this child a gun, please. See you, space boyfriend. That's a good name. <laughs> what happened? Where am I? Who, who are you? Hey there, how you feeling? Oh, uh, hello, I'm Captain Space Boy. It's a pleasure to meet you. Ah, my chest! Oh no, are you okay? You got a little angry earlier, so we had to, you know, beat the shit out of you. Ah, uh, I see. My other half must have gotten the better of me. I must apologize. Your actions were likely well justified. I just hope I didn't cause you all too much trouble. I've been having a hard time controlling my emotions lately. I try my best to keep them at bay, but it's becoming much more difficult. Sweetheart, she was the love of my life. It's almost impossible for me to imagine life apart from her. Guess I'm a bit lost. This special mixtape is full of mine and Sweetheart's favorite songs. I put so much love into making this for her. Thank you all for returning it to me. This is still full of precious memories after all. Hey, it's no problem. Well, not too much anyway. Yeah, we're glad to help. 
You just go ahead and get some rest. I'm afraid no amount of rest can truly heal a broken heart. I must find another way to get over this. Murder works, I think. You should try that one. Captain Sp I mean, Space Boyfriend. Uh, I'm so, so, so sorry, but we have very, very terrible news. Your favorite planet, Pluto, has escaped. We can't find him anywhere. Don't be mad at us. We're sorry. P please be gentle. <laughs> so fucking funny. Yeah, I see. It's okay, you two. I'm sure even the planets get bored during turning slowly all day. Perhaps Pluto was never meant to be a planet. Uh-huh. Really? So you're not angry at us? Do you mean it kept- I mean, space boyfriend? I sure do. Gather the rest of the boys' crew. Let's go to the frozen lake and get some snow cones. Resting in bed may not fix a broken heart, but eating snow cones with friends might help. Also, you don't have to call me space boyfriend anymore. I'm Captain Space Boy! Whoa, wait. Does this mean- Whoa! Hoo! The captain is back! I can't wait to tell everyone! Let's go, dude! Right behind you, buddy. I guess I'm moving really slow for some excited guys. I can't thank you enough for what you've done. Who knows what would happen to me if my crew to my and my crew if you all didn't show up. Aw, oh, it was nothing. We're just glad you're feeling like yourself again. You have my thanks. If you ever need anything from me or the space pirates, please don't hesitate to ask. Actually, I can't believe I forgot about this, but we're actually looking for our friend Basil. He wears a flower crown and always carries his photo album on him. Have you seen him around? Oh uh, well, I've been depressed and in bed, so no. If you see anything, you'll be the first to know. Basil, where could you have gone? Ah, please don't cry, little lady. Here, take this. You got a snow cone ticket. <laughs> uh oh. Please, little lady, don't cry. Uh, here, take this too. Keep crying, Aubrey. Keep crying until he stops giving us stuff. I used to travel around on trains when I was a child, long before I became a space captain. If you and I can go from traveling on trains to flying my own spaceship, I'm sure you'll be able to find your friend. <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, Captain, you ready to go? Everyone's waiting for you. Ah, yes, hold on, I'm coming. That's gross, man. Keep it to yourself. You must keep your hopes up, little lady. If it gets too hard to bear, try to get snow cone. It might make thing a li things a little easier. Ends where to live by. I must keep my crew waiting. Good luck with everything, and thanks again. Your bond with your friends became stronger. Everyone's follow-up moves improved. Yippee! What is that? Oh, another letter. E. We've missed D, I think. Oh, the bloody footprints are back. That's good. Where? How do I access Hangman? There's a button for it. I don't remember what the button is. How's the search for Basil going? Well, Mary, uh, it seems that we've taken a little detour. Just trying to help those in need, you know? Look, Mary, I got a snow cone ticket! Well, that's very nice, Aubrey! Thanks! Mary, look what I can do! That's... very nice too, Kel. <laughs> I know, isn't it? It's so strange. We searched all over the place, but we haven't seen a hint of Basil anywhere. Oh, Basil. I wonder where he could have gone. There must be something we're missing. Do you have any leads, Amori? Ah, yes, some lovely space tube food. <laughs> I don't have any leads. Ah, uh, don't you just love the smell of firewood and the smell of warm water and this crisp blah 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 blah. Yes, uh, it helped me with Basil. I've been 
think maybe you best not to go somewhere important in a rush. But where have we gone? Why wouldn't you tell us about it? So we didn't end up in any trouble. Cool. Unhelpful. Nope. You did not. <laughs> Poor Kel. There he goes. <laughs> See you later, man. You're the best. still in the frickin' prologue? Oh, I can't stick my hand into that one. Hmm. It's such a long walk every time. I don't need to go down there, but I know you can water these plants more. Um, I guess we could go back to the pineal forest, although I don't know how much that helps us. Oh, yeah, we have quests to turn in. <sighs> hey, man, come here for me. Oh, did you want something burly? Yeah, stand right there and look that way. Okie dokes. Aubrey, come here. Uh, what do you want now, Bur Burly? Aubrey! Aubrey, 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 Aubrey! What's with that sassy tone? Come on, we're best friends. Now, you see that big guy over there? I know who Van is. Great! Go and give him a good whacking for me. What? What? Why? What if he gets hurt? Always with the questions. Can't you just do something without thinking for once? Go on, smash! In a second. Oh, okay, never mind. Alright, we shall do it now. You tagged Aubrey! Okay, there I did it. Now what? Do it again! Do it until I say stop! What the fuck?! Okay, but what am I doing exactly? No questions, only smash! Hey Van, are you alright? Oh, hell yeah. You're getting somewhere, I think. Come on, you can do it. Stamina, stamina. Are we trying to smash him open? Does he turn into candy? How long do I have to keep doing this? Until I say stop, don't slow down now! <laughs> My arms feel like noodles. Keep pushing, you're almost there. Bro is fucking bruised up to hell. I think I'm gonna pass out. Please, just one more smash. <laughs> ah, yeah. And he falls over and dies. <laughs> what was that all about? Nah, nothing really. I was just bored. But honestly, this is pretty boring too. What? That's all? Hey, at least you got something out of it. I'm still bored here. Come on, Van. Let's play some tetherball. I, I just don't get burly at all. Why does Van put up with it? Is that a 
flower puzzle for me. <gasps> Maybe Neville thought he knows me now. Oh no, I said his name. Please pretend you didn't hear that. Thank you for the flower puzzle. Here's a gift in return. I picked a bunch of them earlier. Aren't they pretty? Got a daisy from Daisy. I wonder when I should give this to him. Jesus Christ, we are still in the prologue. Nutty. Absolutely nutty. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> no rewards, sorry. No, no saying castles. We're busy. I guess we have the crow thing, although that doesn't seem super important. Eternal banana. Um, where do we want to go for... The... coming up, it's this way, right? Ah, shit. Rabbits. Oh, wait. Are these tracks? Are these the same tracks? Hit that pinwheel. Spaghetti! Oh, is that another key? Can only Mori grab keys? See. Didn't we have this one? Oh, we didn't get it again because of the... we lost. I forgot. Oh, there's a beanie. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> oh, I grabbed that. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Just a boy with this kite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yourself sad. If we make ourselves sad and we make him happy, I'm worried he's gonna be doing mad. Wait, where's all our. Where's all my juice? <laughs> Shit. Uh, Kel, could you. juice up, uh. still doing mad damage to me. Okay, stab this idiot kid. Uh, you make him happy. We definitely got him this time. Stab him again! Keep stabbing him! Keep eating 
them up. Aubrey's in a bit of a pickle. Okay, who's our fastest? I think Kel is our fastest. case we can't release our energy so might as well mess them up nice whiff idiot Alive. Okay, you gotta be pretty low. Yeah. We got you this turn. Kids kind of swoops down. Oh shit. That's some mad damage. But that's okay. Ooh! Fuck him up! Kind of an unbreakable bond. How could we lose? Oof. Aubrey didn't get the level up. That's sad. Maybe me and my kite should try and fly somewhere else. Unfortunate. Now Aubrey will be behind in levels. And we also wasted an item. Play kites with your friends? Yeah! Yippee! Is that it? Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll fight a, a rabbit. I think he loses these. Blood was leading up there, but nothing up there. Is the blood gone? <laughs> Shit. How are they living all these hits? They don't have them in this many hit points. <laughs> Here, this was the tire swing, right? Yeah. Alright, well, I'm honestly not sure what I should be doing, so maybe we call it. I'm trying to think. What did we get? We got snow cones, so we can we can ride a train. Oh, we can ride a train! That's where we're supposed to go. Yeah. Obviously, where was the train station? It was off this way.
does the enemy HP scale with your level? And if so, they should be giving more experience, I think. Bunnies? No. Nope. Gotta kill more bunnies. Yeah, I know. What tomfoolery is this? I demand you let me see my family at once. Do I look like a Tom to you? Screen my ear and gonna make the train run any faster, lady. said train station. Everyone here is so different and interesting. I wonder what makes me different and interesting. Pookie gets done easily, but he just needs someone to listen to sometimes, and that someone is me. Uh... Hero, you want to help with this? I think, I mean, we've been streaming for a long, long time, so probably cut it there anyways. Ah, we will be back next week, hopefully, with more. It's, uh, it's, it's fun. I mean, I, again, uh, RPG stuff is fine. It's not too bad. I mean, I've been enjoying it enough. I like the characters. The characters are great. They're all very likable. I do want more of that fucking spooky shit, though. Give me more spooky shit. Anyways, that is gonna be it for tonight, so thank you for joining. It was nice to see so many new faces around today. I appreciate it. Thank you all for joining. Um, normally, for those of you who aren't familiar with me, generally stream on Fridays. Uh, so hopefully we'll be back next Friday, unless something absolutely insane happens and I'm unable to, like, the past couple of weeks. But, uh, yeah. So, anyways, we'll be back with more and more then. Thank you, and good night.